<laughs> this episode nine. <laughs> this, this is, well, all right, man. Yeah, what you say, eight point five or whatever you want to call yeah. that motherfucker? Yeah, I'm gonna go seven point five. <laughs> see what we got. We on. Let me see. Let me get on here. Yeah, hit your vibrate too. That's exactly what I'm about to do. That's that nigga Spencer mm. ass. <coughs> mm, we on. Oh. Yeah. 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 You already know, man. Tony Snow's show. Episode nine. Big My nine. Bad. Yeah, episode nine, man. Tony Snow show. It's been a crazy down eight episodes. I appreciate y'all even fucking with me, man. Through all of this shit, man. Cause everywhere I go, somebody talking about the podcast. That's a good thing. That mean we need to get this bitch cracking. Uh <laughs> yeah, yeah, Spence. We hung up on your ass, nigga. Welcome to the show though, man. I got two guests in here with me today. I'm gonna let them introduce themselves. We're gonna start off with the ladies. I'm Devin. Okay, child. Simple. I like that. I like that. That's how you know. <laughs> She's a lost, the last name is way too long. We don't even just Devin K. Devin K. Nails by Devin. Uh, oh, so God. Right. Shit, everybody already know who I be, man. It's your boy What's T. Burner, man. Correct government name, Terrence Alexander, man. Right. Feel me? T.A. T.A. T. Burner. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, What's happening? Tony Snow Show, episode nine. We got Devin on here tonight. Devin is going... <sighs> She got some shit for y'all, so I'm gonna let her talk. Devin, what 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 is our first topic that people gotta know? Um, the the first topic would be, like I said, choosing to live a single lifestyle. Mm. Choosing to live a single lifestyle. Now, mm. I, I gotta hear this because I, I guess I do got some input on this one. Go ahead, go ahead and start us off, Devin. Shit. Okay, well, um, basically I'm choosing to speak about the topic because it's a lifestyle of mine. Um, after dating and trying different relationships, I just felt like there was not many men on my level. So I chose to build myself, build my education, further my intelligence, put my work into my businesses. And maybe, you know, when I get to where I'm going, then I might be able to find a, a decent partner. But for right now, I think I'm just like You're choosing this. To, to I'm be choosing to be single. Hey, everything you just said, that's like a nice way of saying fuck these niggas. Most definitely. Like I'm choosing to work on myself and school. And you know, I like that, though. God like that. got me. And, like you that. know, he ain't going to never let me down. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I mean, there's nothing wrong with like having uh, friends. You know what I'm saying? Sure. Communication, hanging out, and stuff like that. For but sure. I'm just not. I'm just not looking to give anybody my time. All right. Yes. So when you choose to be single, do you still have sex, or is is like, yeah, that's off limits too? Um, at at specific points, sex can be off limits. Um, for most of this year, actually, I practice celibacy. Um, choosing not to give anybody my body But it, it's not like oh you know Fuck these niggas I'm so bitter It's more like when I share my energy With someone I need to know that they're deserving Of Respected, my energy and yeah. my body So Respected. I'm not just gonna just give it out to anybody Like because you know I, I have sexual needs I think I can put that to the side Nice facts Hey Devin man I'm gonna tell you Woman like Hey I'm gonna tell you now you a soul survivor, cause I don't know. Besides, when I was locked up, that's the only time I can say I, I'm gonna go without sex. I ain't gonna lie to you. Yeah, and that's single, not single. The only time I went without sex when I was locked up. Now that I'm out, man, hell no. Nah. This <laughs> man helicoptering and everything. <laughs> you hear me? You know. I'm helicoptering that thing in your yeah, face. Yeah, I, I see your No cap. No cap. <laughs> it gotta be a fat bitch though. It's like this. <laughs> it gotta be fat, cause if she's skinny, I feel like my Dick went too strong, it'll blow ass away. Okay. So that's why I, I said a big cheek. Helicopter. Shout out to the BBWs yeah. out there. Shout okay. out to y'all. What's that? But back on you, Devin. We ain't gonna get too sidetracked. No problem. Um, so yes, back to being successfully being single. single. Um, like I said, choosing Choosing to, to be single. Yes, yes, choosing to be single. Mm -hmm. Um, working on myself right now. Like I said, I am going to school to become a dental hygienist. I'm a straight mm -hmm. A student. Um, mm -hmm. I have two businesses. Shout out to that. Shout out to that. Ain't too many. Right. Straight right. A students. Right. 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 Yes, it's, it's I tough. I squeak Bible by a <laughs> D. <laughs> <laughs> I was a straight D student, but I made it, guys. Yeah, as long as you sure. pass. Um, Shit. Which that program is pretty tough to get 
in too, so you kind of have to have straight A's if you oh, think you're sure. gonna get in. Okay. Um, I'm but glad like I said, you're putting on. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, building the nail salon, which I have a new location coming up um, on Corbin Avenue. Uh, I have a skincare line, and uh, like I said, I just remember like working my way through school. Uh, I used to be an exotic dancer, as many people know. I used that as a, a way to support myself as a single mother, sure. uh, put myself through school. Um, I've built my business, and I try to, you know, keep my class at all time. I think it's, it's very important for women to maintain some type of level of class. I see a lot of our black women, like, online, twerking, like, ass out, like, I don't understand. Like, if you're an artist, like, why do you need to twerk during your performance? Ooh. Mm. I mean, that's part of the performance. Yeah. Yeah. That's sales. Yeah. Sex sales. Sex, sex sales. sales. Sex sales. Yeah, the me. sex like, sales, of course. But at the same time, I understand, you know, it's a, you know, a line for that. Yeah. Have that class and then I also get on that, you know, little nasty level. But, yeah. yeah everybody wants, like, the six-figure guy, but what are you going to do to keep him? Ah, that's a topic within itself. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. let's talk about it. Shit, how do you keep a six-figure nigga besides that used vagina, baby? Mm. That's the question I want to know, because when, when I say, hey, baby, I want to fuck with you, but you giving me some pussy that got, you know, a hundred and... <laughs> Some miles 200, over on 200, it. Well, okay, 237,000 miles. That motherfucker got an oil leak, transmission in slipping in third gear. <laughs> <laughs> four kids. She say tricks are for kids, and she got four of them motherfuckers. You. Hell no. Yeah, baby. I just Look. feel like by the time you're 60, like you're, you're not going to have any vagina Ain't left. Have, oh, man. Like I still want to have a really I good I don't vagina. know, David. They got so many surgeries right now. I feel like they got a surgery. They can, they can bring that back to life. Walls. Shit. Well, Dr. Miami probably what? got something you put in that motherfucker. It's like a magnet. Clip mm. them things together. I don't want none Hallelujah. of that shit. I, I want to stay natural. I understand. Shit to be grass shout out to them natural people. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, shout out to everybody tuning in, man. Shout out to you. Uh, we got somebody from heaven on here, man. Bishop Modelo on here, man. Oh, Lord. <laughs> man, We just keep us lifted up in prayer, man. We, do, we trying, man. We trying. Call in number right there. Y'all make sure y'all call in and yeah. talk to Devin. Tell Devin why y'all choose to be single. Or tell Devin why y'all don't want to be single. Call into that call in number right there. Shit, I love being she single. She listening. Yes. She ready for y'all calls. I don't be afraid. Topic is choosing to be single and successful. That was Devin's idea, and we running with it. Okay. So, Devin, we back on you. Mm-hmm. You said sex was a here and there. When do you feel like you can give in, like, when is the right time to give in? Like, has this person been a friend? Or is it a new person? Do you go back to, like, one of your old people on the hit list? You know what I'm saying? Um, <clears throat> I've scrolled up and down a, a hit list uh, ah, from time to time. Ah, mm -hmm. A little black book. Yeah. yeah, I mean, sometimes when you consider, when you talk about your mouths, like, you think you're not necessarily putting on mileage if you're going back That's to your true. hit list. Facts. But are you, though? Are you? <clears throat> I, I think you I think you might still yeah because I mean you don't know where they been or what uh, yeah, what they've been doing yeah that's a point you know what I'm saying like you helicoptering dick all over Concord hey yo hey yo <laughs> let me tell you something now. let me tell you something y'all know I get the helicopter in that motherfucker man hey. don't play with me hey. don't fucking play with me man. <laughs> This thing ain't got no mileage, but hey, that motherfucker will swing. Hey, you hear me? Motherfucker say it land everywhere. Man, T, how you feel about choosing to be single? You at, you a single brother right now? Oh yeah, I'm single. By the T, way, is it by choice, T? Or is it, it they ain't shit? It ain't nothing out here. It's by choice for real. It's by choice. You will know when that right one, you know, come across you. You feel me? Energy, and then reciprocating of you know things that y'all both have a nature of. Feel me? Other than that, man, that shit is nothing. Say nothing. That. Mm. Say that. And so, nothing. question for both of y'all. If the right person came into y'all life right now, would y'all both be single? Would y'all be open to the relationship or y'all too busy for that shit? Devin? I'm Answer too that, busy. Bro. Like, you're going to really yeah, have yeah, to, yeah, you're going to have really have to push me and put me into a place. Like, you're really going to have to, like, really knock me off my feet. Like, you Ooh. tell them, like, I, I, like how I feel, everybody would love to be in a relationship with me, but I'm just not. No, you ain't like got time, time for that. I shit. really don't have time. Like, and she it's really a budget. distraction. She like, ain't budget. I get a boyfriend, I start making bees. Nigga, you out of here. 
You got to go. Ooh, you, hey, you going to blame it on him, right? No, nah, I mean, but to be honest, I've noticed that I have less focus. You know, like when I'm cooking and making corn three different types of ways. You know, mm. or, you know, taking you out or, you know, staying up late at night with your boyfriend. Like, sometimes you become a little less focused. That is true. On your facts, goals. It's facts. just natural for you that's to put your energy somewhere else and then it naturally gets subtracted. Hey, that's true. Hey, uh, shout out to Vernon Spencer like Milton Jr. He said he's single because he like tricking off, man. He like paying $40, $40 for that. Spence told me one man. time he paid $38 in two loose <laughs> for some pussy. <laughs> And Thirty eight dollars of two fucking Lucy's. That's, a, that's, a that's another story. thing. Like the the value has went down completely. Mm. It, it's completely. cut. Right. It's cut. It's cut. It's exactly. Stepped on. That's just yeah. stepped on. Gucci prices are very <laughs> you stepped did. on. <laughs> you did stepped on. Hey, yeah, I'm yo. like, y'all go ahead and handle it. Man, say the Gucci prices stepped on. They man. really are. Yeah, I Damn. need a little bit more than um, the prices and the product both stepped on. Both of them. Yeah, I want more than cut. forty dollars. Both. So you have some land. What's your credit score? Oh, and man. it's gotta have some quality with that thing. Like, gotta have, yeah. yeah. Cause I, 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 I got a, I got a nigga, man. He like, he tell me that he fuck with multiple women, cause each woman got something different. Okay, they bring a different thing to him. He fuck with such and a such with the head. He fuck with such and such cause she more caring and loving than mom. Like he fuck with such and such cause she with that freak shit. She it's, gonna have like. No, they gonna be having threesomes and all that shit. Uh, but with the next bitch, is that man. how y'all break y'all you know niggas saying? down the same way? Uh, yes. Okay. Very much so. so we got a caller right here. We're gonna go ahead and take this call. Okay. Caller number one, holla at me. Yes, sir. You know who it is, nigga. Vernon Spencer Milton Jr. the third. The bishop. Aaron Tate. The bishop. Aaron Tate, right here. It works live from work. Church. You know, church. Hey, man. Live from work. Hey, tell us why you single, man. Why why, why, you, why you feel like you need to be single? Because, man, I like to trick off. I'm be honest with you, man. You know. <laughs> you know oh, that boy taking accountability finally. If you see me, it takes the work so, me having a man. So you don't mind you know? paying for the pussy. I ain't say paying for the pussy, first of all. Let's, let's, let's talk about that. Now, look. What's God your definition say, of tricking out? My definition of tricking out, you paying for that thing. You cashing out. No, 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 no. You're going to pay her gold. You're going to take them out to eat. You're going to get their hair done. Exactly. Right? You're going to have to do certain shit. That's trick. I feel you. Yeah, he trick. Yeah, that's, that's, that's tricky. tricky. That's tricky. Yeah. Uh, question. The day, what's the most you ever paid for some vagina? What we want to know. And was it good? For how many hours? For how many hours? Damn. Oh, oh you, you paid per hour. <laughs> per hourly. <laughs> nigga had an hourly service. <laughs> Damn. Wow. Hey, How much you hey, paid I'm, for I'm per hour, my, man? I'm going to get my money worth that. I'm going to get my money worth that motherfucker. You hear me? Boy. Um, shit. Back in my younger days, I was like, I was getting I was pretty good at the strip club. You know, Sugar Bears, Onyx, Tameo. We um, want a price. What's the highest you ever, what's the most you ever paid for, some, for, for some pussy, man? Two hundred. Look, not about that dollar, bro. You said what? I live bit more than that. Oh, you, oh, you, you was out here paying. Cause let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. He said he paid a little more than two hundred. Oh yeah. Good God. Boy, let me tell you. It was back in my younger days though when I was stupid and dumb. You see? Boy, hey, let me tell you, power boy. Power to you, power to you, bro. Hey, boy, we gonna keep you lifted up in prayer, man. Yeah. Cause ain't no please, way. Please, please, please. That's Vernon uh, Milton Jr. The you third, can, right? But look, you, 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 can, you can do that. You can do that when you're the bishop. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, I was, I was using church money. I was using church money. Using church money. Hey, hey, hey. Oh Lord, <laughs> Bishop Modelo, if you still on here, man, just just put your hands in there. Put heal that man, man. He out here paying. Just, just, just keep lifting up in the name of Two fifty for. Come on, we are gonna bring him in. Hold on, hold on. Let me bring you in. Stay, stay right there. Hey, how y'all doing? Uh, this is the uh, the Reverend Deacon Bishop PGG. Mm. Brother Caldwell, we just want to just, God, we just thank you for waking us up this morning, putting clothes on our back, food on the table, and allowing us to see another day. Lord, we got our call on the phone, and he's struggling right now, Lord. He say he he paying for that pussy you put down here on this earth, Lord. But ain't nothing wrong with it, Lord, because you put it on earth for him. We just ask you, just, just you just guide him, Lord. Just give him guidance. Look, guidance. That's all. In Jesus' name we pray. Uh, amen. Amen. 
Spence, we thank you for calling, nigga. Hey. Keep tuning in with us, man. All right, bro. Let's clap it up for that boy, Spence, man. Yeah, hey, man. We proud of you, nigga. Yes, sir. Hey. Keep doing your thing. Hey, keep America great, baby. Keep America great, Please, man. God. It's niggas like you that make America great, man. Tell Trump to holler at you, man. man. Thank you. Thank, hey, hey, thanks for calling in, man. Be safe. Devin, man, we back on you, man. Let's do it. Hey, Devin said the topic was uh, being choosing to be single and right. successful. Right. Devin, continue. Um, let's see. Let's go deeper into it. Mm. Um, mm. The reason I why like I deep. made these choices is because <laughs> I, I think I can be a, a little bit intimidating, or at least that's what I've been told. Mm. You put your hands on this. Nah, I, I'm not aggressive at all. Uh, I, I think that I actually have things to talk about. And, you know, when you're talking about your business, I'm talking about mine when we're discussing our day. Mm -hmm. Like, I actually, like, follow up on what you told me yesterday. Like, if you say, hey, babe, we can go get this part for this car. Like, okay, well, did y'all finish today? Mm. And I think a lot of niggas just be putting on and not mm -hmm. really being mm -hmm. honest, you know. So. Uh -huh. I, I don't know. I, I would like to know, like, if there's any other ladies who felt like they've been intimidating to men. Um, I don't I don't think it's right to to, like, water yourself down. Hey, I'm with you. Hey, ladies, hey, call in. That's the number right there. Call in. We want to hear your side of the story. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Because hey, she's speaking some real shit. I know some motherfuckers out here. <laughs> they be <laughs> capping just to be capping. <laughs> need to take that advice. I'm telling yeah. you. Yeah. But hey, Devin brought notes, y'all. I want y'all to know this, so I'm letting Devin get her notes out. Devin, continue. <laughs> Shout out to that notebook. Hey, we having a good time. Man. We having a good time. Um, What's next in your book of notes, Devin? Yeah. That's really. I I don't really have a lot. I really talked pretty much about like every everything that I really wanted to bring up. Um, she I'm is comfortable with you guys one. asking me questions. Shout out to one man. Hey, she is a real one. Yeah. Thank you. <clears throat> well, Devin, let me tell. You, let me. I, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go the opposite right from y'all too. Now, right now, I am single. Okay. But I don't consider myself single because I'm trying to like uh, talk to something. Like, not nah, we more than talking. Okay. I'm trying to get to take somebody to that next level. You so know you're dating. Saying? Oh yeah, most definitely. I'm doing All more right. than dating, baby. Okay. <laughs> hey. Hey, I'm doing more today. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, nah. Hey, yeah, I'm boy. out here. Hey. So, but yeah, I, and I, and I did choose to be single because I just had a lot going on in life with, you know, the police and baby mama and the kids and then the job. And I was like, damn, man, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't right for no. I'm for no glad right you now. breaking that down, you know how you saying? breaking that down, because I was about to go back to that when you said, you know, being single. Yeah, mm -hmm. like it's yeah. a choice because certain people, they may have certain things going on mm -hmm. that other folks may not understand. Shit, okay. shit. And, you know, like, people may not reciprocate the same way that you communicate with them. Yeah. Okay. That, so a, a lot of that shit play a part. Well, let's talk about why <laughs> men can't be honest. Like, if you have something going on, I'm if you have know. a situation, mm -hmm. if you got a baby due. Hey, yo, come on. No. <laughs> Like, what? I'm just kids out of this, I'm, no, I'm, I'm, I'm being honest. Like there's, there's been like the people I've known. Like you know, you talking to a guy and he just drops off the face of the earth and then he pops back just up. Ghost you, just well, ghost. Well, like twin babies. I'm hey. like, what the fuck? I know. About he, he didn't want to hurt your feelings. Yeah. Yeah. He didn't want to tell you he had them two twins on the way. Hurt my feelings. Come on now. This is fun. A hey, kids will hey. help you. A hey, kids will yeah. get y'all up out of there quick. Yeah. And then back to the intimidation part. You said maybe he just felt he couldn't really be that. So honest with you because your reaction. But if I if it. I state that I I would like for you to be honest, like we have a whole conversation about, about you being honest. Yeah, oh. like that's never been. Yeah, like let's be real. Like you know what I'm saying? You got three, four bitches on the side. You're married. <laughs> you have a wife. Like, <laughs> like, shout out to him, man. <laughs> yeah, he just didn't want to be honest. Dude. Hey, he shout out to you, just man. Cake you, and eat it too. If you out there with three, four bitches on the side, man, and the wife at home, man, you doing your thing, man. Hey. Nadeja said, damn, are you talking about my BD? No. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Come on damn. now. What would Jesus do? He wouldn't say nothing like that. Nah. We're not I using mean, anybody else's personal Kaya. situations. Facts. Kaya said, men are intimidated by women who have their shit together. Mm. They hit you up with no real intentions. 
So when when the woman starts speaking, they ain't ready for that ready shit. For that they ain't ready for that shit. Goes back to what she what um, Devin said. Be honest, keep it real. Keep got to keep it all the way funky. I, I feel like all anytime I told a chick what I wanted from the beginning, like look, girl. I just want to fuck you on Wednesdays. Or look, I fuck with it you. It all work out. It always works out. Yeah, day. I would love oh, to organize man. something like work. that. Like, let's set up it is 8 every five every it, Saturday. You feel like, me? You know? Every Wednesday. Like, let me schedule you into my planner. <laughs> yeah, like, like I would really enjoy that. Look at God. But, yeah, no, people people can't be honest. And then, you know. Uh, like, hold up, Deb. Hold up, hold up. Man, shout out to that motherfucking scheduled pussy out here, man. Hey, good you know Lord. man. Yes. Hey, y'all help. Y'all help keep it, keep it all these black men strong out here. But to you, Devin. Um, yeah, I think it, you know, like going into gender roles, um, what men are supposed to do, like what they're supposed to pay for. Like sometimes we get too tied up into, you know, what's going to be your job, what's going to be my uh, job. Yeah. Like let's Facebook. have a conversation about roles. I feel like social media Killing that, a, big part. Uh, a very big uh, part of that. Okay, why do you feel like that? Like, what do you see on social I media that like, makes? I don't know. I just feel like a lot of women they idolize other people's relationships, like celebrities and shit like that, and they want that. But the nigga you weak can't provide that, baby. Yeah, you know got the accepting. He can't. <laughs> he can't. I think everybody it. should be realistic, and then it. But on yeah, that too, facts. like they should stop putting so much stress like on our men. On that person. Oh, like we have it, men yeah. going to prison, catching charges because you want some fucking Versace ah, shoes. Like, I bitch, go get you yes. some Versace bread. Yes, Devin, we gonna clap it up for you because I well, she hit that shit on the motherfucker. Like, this is where I went to prison for. Your mama to don't want to wanna pay no. Yeah, your mama don't want to pay. Her own bills. Your sister's not paying their bills. Your baby mama Lord. needs stuff. Like, oh, what is man. one man to do? Hey, that, but ain't nobody trying to help this man legitimize his money, get a laundry mat, right. uh, go to school, and get him together. Yeah, man. But sometimes, have all the sometimes money. a nigga need help. A real nigga, no sometimes cap. A real nigga need help. Nah, for real. That's some real shit. Right and we there. appreciate it when y'all do it. Yeah, Hell yeah. Like, I feel like. When I get that that type of love right there, I, I like I fucking just I don't know. Everything will change. Everything change. I didn't want a you girgirlfriend, did, but now, uh, baby, now I'm I ready to get married. I'm telling you. Yeah. I'm yeah. Cause, like, cause damn. you done showed us. You done showed me something. You yeah, me? it's like, like what what else can you use like besides your pussy to keep someone? Like I yeah. I want a nigga to be like, nah, I can't. You can't fuck this up. What I got? Yeah, uh, yeah. Got to bring you more, baby. You can go. You got to bring you more, go. Baby. <laughs> you yeah. go. <laughs> you bring nah, more with you. Yeah, you gonna be afraid to get rid of me. Nah, that's facts. Oh, that's how man. I feel. Facts. I, I, that's a great question. What more can y'all offer besides the pussy? Because boy, y'all, they don't be having shit to offer. See, they got. Uh, 17,000 followers on Instagram. They don't follow nobody back. Talk to him. She get about 2,000 likes. Talk to him. She was popular in high school, so now she's still trying to live off that little high school fame. Say what? Barely goddamn working. Mm. It's always cash at me this, cash at me that. What? But they want a six-figure nigga with a 12-inch dick and all this. Hello. Like, what the hell are you talking about, baby? I have no idea. What the hell is you talking about, baby? Yeah, like, and then, like, nobody's trying to like further their education like i feel like once i become a dental hygienist like i'll be in the same room with some doctors some you know facts. what i mean maybe and i could be like deserving of dating like what makes you think a doctor wants to and that's what makes you date different the cna from a lot of these other bitches out here you Man, i don't want, women out here like i don't want nobody but you, you focused and uh you got goals chicoy working on my teeth <laughs> right uh, Yeah They gonna put you in the game hey, 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 Oh yeah Only two I need y'all Keep me straight now Yeah for sure that For sure that though T I'm back on you Now you broke it down While you were single You broke it down If the person came along You I mean you would be open to it Definitely would But <clears throat> How do you know what's the Who's the right person Like what's gonna be That different thing She bringing First off The understanding Of certain things Ah she got to understand your shit. Yeah, you got to understand my, my area, my my shit, what I got going on. If you're willing to operate with me and knowing that I'm willingly respecting you and everything else that you want and I'm granting, then, hey, that's all I ask of you. You feel me? Disrespect it. Other than mm-hmm. that, I'm going to remain single and do me because, you know, it's 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 a lot of things that just got to be respected when it comes with that. You feel me? And you got to understand 
Gotta understand. I don't need no person who you feel me like out of line about something when I done kept it real with you. Uh, like, uh, yes. What's the reason to go there? I told you I'm everything. You. What's you an me? example of that? Like them being out of line or not <laughs> respecting? Like, well, where where are these boundaries being crossed? Like, you know how like okay, you know how certain women and certain females they be like, oh, I got my little jealous bone in my body, uh, you know, da 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 and stuff like that. You know, so it's like this is a person that you shouldn't even. Feel that type of way about if she's in the room with you because she's right. not even on that type of right. level with you. You feel right. me? So yeah. control that. Right. Or mm. I just keep you out of that that equation. Well, some people me? like that that amount of toxicity in their relationship. And I'm one go. of them niggas that don't. Here we I go. So don't do it. Here we go. <laughs> Is it coming up? Is it burning you? Uh, like, <laughs> I've been there. I don't you like the. I don't like it. I don't. It's not cute to me. Like you getting jealous or you being on my ass about it's, it's like. Turn off. And just because I'm a beautiful woman doesn't mean like because somebody's speaking to me, I actually want to deal with them. Thank like, you. I have a choice. Of course, I'm beautiful, but Thank that doesn't you. mean that anybody could just get me. You better be lucky. You got. Uh, Hello. Hey, got? shout out to you for getting that, man. Y'all heard what she what said, right? Did. Say, say that one more time for me, uh, Miss Devin. Say that one more time. You know what? You better be lucky you here. Mm. I, I'm mm. just saying, like, Mm-mm-mm. no, I'm just saying, like, appreciate, appreciate your woman. Don't try to throw them down all the time, like, blaming them for cheating or looking through their phone. Or, oh, you was talking to it. I was at the club with a guy I had met, and I think um, that's, I think that's twisted, though. What? I think the women do that more than the men. Yeah. Really? I feel like it, last yeah. week on the episode. I feel like too. It was chicks telling me how I was toxic and all that. They don't even fucking know me. How you know I'm fucking toxic, baby? You don't know what I did. I think people just throw words <laughs> out there image, like they don't that really image, understand that, the definition. Intimidation. Like, yeah. shit. I ain't did nothing to half of y'all on here. What the hell? You know what I mean? I'm toxic. Intimidation, you know man. That intimidation. Yeah, I think. It, they say I look like a cheater. How you? What a cheater look like? <laughs> Who I'm supposed to be cheating on? When I got the one I want, that's who I want. I ain't got to hey, cheat on You feel me? Ain't got yeah. to it all. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think I think women definitely do it more. But that mm-hmm. those are those self esteem issues that you know people are not dealing with. And then why do you have these self esteem issues? Do you feel like you're hiding your something. game? Thank you. Mm. Mm. Are you, are you upset because it's a bad bitch out there with uh, a fatter ass and a bigger degree? Oh, that's like tough. let's really talk Ooh, about it. That's talk tough. to Man, him. That's a, a bad ass combination. I swear to God, boy, that's a one fat too. ass and a bigger degree. How you yeah. compete with that? Oh, you thought I was feeling you? No, she went to ICDC. So I got that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Shout out to ICDC College, you man. Did. Hey. Little Romeo Master P. Y'all tried that shit, nigga. It ain't work, but shout out to y'all anyway. Hey, for real, for real. I wonder, like, what kind of partnership or what it, like, I ain't never seen nobody doing commercials for colleges. Like, I would really like to know, like, how to fuck. Since those days, you right? You remember like, that, man, nigga. Hey. I remember it. You remember I'm, that one nigga? He was like, hey, you ain't doing that what you like. Get up off the goddamn couch. Yeah. What you doing with yourself? You broke ass black <laughs> one. Go to college, go to school. I remember that, nigga. I remember that shit. I used to be like, bitch ass nigga, I am doing something with my life. You don't right. know, nigga. <laughs> Yelling at the TV at that nigga, bro. That shit was crazy. Yeah. You ain't doing shit with your life. Go to college, motherfucker. And they used to play him like all the time. Man, don't be up at 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. You that was the see only that fucking commercial that came repeatedly. on. Repeatedly. It'll be, oh, girls going wild on 18. Show your tits. Ooh. And then it'll go black in there. Boom. What this you doing? Nigga. Why are you just looking at that girl's going After wild commercial? Shit like that. <laughs> Put the lotion down. You finna whack off? Come on now. Go to school. Go to college. Hey, you Put me. your dick down. Looking ass. Oh, God, bro. Yeah, what the he, hell was wrong with that dude, He's man. not getting any helicopter action. Oh, he is. Yeah, nah, exactly. He's a little too exactly. Focused. Hey, yeah. let me tell y'all something. Y'all bringing in this story time real quick. This ain't really a story. This just this this is education. That part. They say the more you know. When you helicopter... Your dick and balls and a chick face, it helps. It's it fol it exfoliate her skin like rose water. <laughs> it helps keep away crow's feet. Lord. And it also keeps uh, it also blows them other niggas out of her life. You get it. <laughs> crow's yeah. feet, Tony, are you fucking cougars? Ooh. Mm. No, I'm not fucking <laughs> I'm not fucking cougars. But have I fucked a cougar? Yeah. God damn right. I Shout out to the Cougars. Shout she out to the put, Cougars. Shit, nigga. She put with putting exotic cars in her name, all type of yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Getting all types of Airbnbs. All they uh, want is that good young meat in that time. 
Man, I yeah. I went down there, Devin, and <laughs> dust went everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> No, God way of no, man, dust nah. went everywhere. Like, damn, baby, you need some pine saw on this motherfucker or something. No, nah, I think not even to get on your rag or nothing like that. I, I think Devin got that that sunshine pussy. Ain't ain't that what uh, Fox said on uh, oh, on, on Harlem wow. Nights? What is the definition of sunshine? Motherfucker pussy? probably smell yeah, like purple <laughs> fabuloso, girl. You know how your mama's a boy. Just, that just 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 that yeah, all around that. Shout out everybody, to Devin, what man. everybody wants. <laughs> Shout out to you Devin, man. If y'all didn't know, Devin is my cousin, man. Shout out to Devin. Shout out to her brother, Jeremy. Yes. yes. Been yes. fucking with them for Hey, me and Jeremy started a business together when we was 12 years old. T&J Lawn Service, man. Facts. And we cut a lot of damn grass. And, uh, man, that's one person I can say, man, we have been hustling since the beginning of the time. Oh, yeah. For real. And that grind. Hell, yeah. <clears throat> how many grass? When you say a lot of grasses, how many grasses? Man, we 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 put a fly in Walmart where you can take your number off and call your ass. Could God Almighty, boy. really? Man, what? <laughs> man, me and Jeremy used to ask him. He Facts. used to like go around to like old people's houses and like and break them. their leaves and yeah. shit. Man, we were cutting grass around that. We would go to like Carowinds, and me and Kevin would be like trying to group together some fucking quarters. Here come Jeremy with a big ass stack of money. Like, oh, yeah. He was yeah. never a kid. Man, we made so right. much money one day. one of those. I took that man shopping, no cap. <laughs> we made so much money, I had my mama drop us off at, when Carolina Mall used to be a thing. Yeah. <laughs> she dropped us off yeah, at Carolina week. Mall, and I took that man shopping. I ain't gonna never forget that. So that's a fact, Yeah, man. shout out shout to out my to brother. Him. Yeah, yeah, he's out, out the bro. country right now. Shout Definitely out shout brother. out to him. Yeah. And, uh, <clears throat> we back on you, though, Devin. Okay. First of all, I want to thank you for even re- coming on the show, man, because oh yeah, we sure. couldn't have made this shit without you. Oh. Same to you, T, man. I appreciate you coming back oh, here really, again Anytime. for a second time. Anytime. 2 P. You guys are so welcome. Yeah. P. I'm, I'm honored to be here. I think I, I watch, and I think it's funny. Um, I be wanting to, like, call in and shit. I talk a lot of shit. I talk <laughs> a lot of shit. I start calling in and shit. Uh, I do talk a lot of shit, uh, and uh, people expect that out of me, and you know... <laughs> I had a I had an older gentleman uh, at the uh, shout out to fucking fucking Mike Mo man at Mike Mo funeral man goddamn oh, yes. R I P Mike Mo Long God damn it, man. Tell you, man man at his funeral I had an older dude said look man you got a hell of a show but sometimes I think you need to clean it up I'm like what you mean clean it up he like I don't want to hear you about about you helicopter your dick all in the <laughs> <laughs> I'm like but man they want to hear that's the shit that's add funny the humor like, in you, man. I'm like, man, anybody that know me know I don't say what I want to say since the beginning of the time. I don't do this shit for no podcast. This is me in real, real life. Yeah, that's, God yeah. Damn that's what right. I tell people. You feel me? Yeah, I, you know, all the time. All the I do time. not do this for a podcast. This is me in real <laughs> life. If you really don't hung around me, you know I talk a lot of shit. I, I'm always smiling. I got a, a million dad jokes. And you're going to eventually laugh at one of them. <laughs> <laughs> for real. But nah, That's back on you, Devin. What made you, you said that you, you know, you said you used to be a dancer back in the day. What made you like, like I feel like some chicks get in that lifestyle, but they get stuck in that damn lifestyle. They said they going to start it for this, but 30 years later, they don't know how to transition. Like, damn, baby, you yeah. still here? Yeah. Like, what made you, how do you know it was the right time, basically? Um. Well, me dancing, how I knew it was the right time, Uh, for one, my son was getting older. Uh, and I didn't want him to like, you know, which I mean, I danced out of town, but you can only imagine like your child getting picked on on the bus. That's why I seen your mama ass last night. <laughs> Come like, on, yeah. so didn't want that to be my son. <laughs> Them boys subscribing uh, early. But, you know, <laughs> all right, <laughs> good. But um, Ooh, no, I had shit. goals like from the beginning. I wanted to put myself through nail school. I wanted to like pay off one of my vehicles. Um, I just. I just never, I just, it was never like something, it wasn't a permanent lifestyle for me. Uh, but however, I think that that does feed into the intimidation. Mm-hmm. Like when people know that about me, they're like, oh, like, well, maybe she's like some type of super freak. And it's like, I'm mm-hmm. just a nail tech from Concord. Hey, yo, hey, yo, daddy. I'm pausing real quick, man. Hey, shout out to y'all super freaks, man. Super uh, freak. Let me tell y'all something, boy. Never mind. Go go ahead, Dave. Go ahead, Dave. We're gonna say that for another day. Go ahead, yeah, yo. Yeah, well, like I said, um, I danced for about nine years, 
and I had goals going into it. Um, but it's it's like a it's it's like just it's just a job. You go in, you work. You well, your shift manipulate the, the room. You. Yeah, you manipulate the room and you keep fucking sliding. Like, I just get Man. my bread and, and handle my business. So, look, the stiff to you. Work that thing a little bit. All right. I'm going to get it right. I feel you on that, Devin. I'm proud of you for you making the transition because I'm telling you, there's a lot of ladies that can't make that transition. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's stuck, a very tough man. transition. Like, right. it, it's, it's like, it's like a dope dealer Nothing, trying to stop easy. selling yeah. dope. Right. Right. Jesus, you know, how do you tough. tell a dope dealer to go get like a Ooh. regular job? Like, Ooh, tell me a When that's all challenge. that he knows. Yeah. Oh, but, man. you know, it definitely wasn't hey, all that I knew. <laughs> yeah, I feel you, man. But some people don't have some people don't have any other options. So hey, shout out to Jazz, man. Jazz tuned in, man. She yeah, said, hey. hey boo. Hey, shout out to Mister Boom Clap himself, man. Mikey lies on this motherfucker, man. What's happening? What's up, Cub? Mister Boom Clap himself, man. That boy. The he creator fool, of that boom clap. Be rolling, bro. Motherfucker, boy. Hey, he the creator of the boom clap, man. Shout out to him, man. For real. <laughs> Nah, but I feel you on that, uh, Devin. That's because, like I said, a lot of people can't make that transition, even with the drug dealer. Man, it, it's hard to make that transition. It yeah, just, the world don't give a fuck about who you used to be. You know, they want to know what you got going on now. Right now, yeah, yeah. yeah, I definitely think so. Like, Damn. and I, I think it's it's also important to like continue evolving. Like, definitely. I always try, like I said, furthering your education, building businesses. Um, I really like, like, during the pandemic, like, people were coming up, like, selling plates and making cupcakes. Yo, Bitches making hustling, hey, all it, any hustling, way they could. Nah. And now you finally got <laughs> black people to be like, uh, you know, well, we don't want to go back to work and work this hourly wage. You know what I'm saying? I've been making $1,000 a week selling drinks. On like, my own, like. Yeah, bitch, like, welcome. It started. You felt like they started waking up a lot more. Than yeah. Right then, right oh, there. absolutely. Absolutely. Like, you got to gotta be able to. Put yourself in that type of growth mindset. A lot of people just want you to stay stagnant so they can continue to get rich. Like you, you gotta, you gotta think forward. Definitely gotta think ahead. Hey, I'm with you on that, man. Mm-hmm. Cause uh, I man, I, I don't know. It, it's like shit going good out here, but at the same time, the world fucking crazy, man. Like I don't know. It's been crazy. It's just getting crazier. So speaking of that, like, how do you guys feel like as black men with all of the Violence and stuff going on. Like, does it like what? I'm I'm saying like, has it gotten normal? Like the stuff that happened with oh, Takeoff yeah. and like Nipsey. So oh, like, yeah, is this it shit definitely it's, normal it's normalized now? now. Yeah, yeah, I'm starting to get used to it too. Like, that's so now. crazy. It's, it's definitely normalized. Going to somebody's funeral every week. <clears throat> yeah. And then other folks like back to what you said, like how the people be wanting you to be stagnant with that when you in. That frame or that lane, you just got to also know how to move, too. Mm-hmm. Straight up. Know when to be somewhere and when knowing not to be somewhere. Because mm-hmm. you never may know what the fuck going to go on. Oh, tell me about it. Yeah, like, I I don't, sometimes I don't understand, like, how people get into these situations. Like They get themselves into them situations. Yeah, like, if I got money, I'm not shooting no fucking dice on no, like, we're not, hey. I'm not playing no games. Man, let me tell you. Them niggas just get bored, man. Yeah, for real. They got so, so, they much, got so money much money. Yeah. yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. That's a fact. Yeah, I didn't hear of the niggas doing some crazy shit because they got so much money and bored. It could get crazy out there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Definitely. And it's like I seen a post on. I think I said this last week. I seen a post on Facebook. It said you Long put your take off, man. No, it's f- for real. <clears throat> Absolutely. It said you put your fourteen year old son in karate, and his fourteen year old out here going to school with glocks with switches on. <laughs> And that's some real shit. Yeah, for, for real. real. Like, why you put your kid in karate and these niggas is toting guns? Yeah, with I mean, switches. Man, damn it! I used to talk a lot of shit to people. I try to keep the peace with everybody now because I don't know who the hell, what the hell, somebody got going on now. Yeah, like you never crazy. know. Yeah, the young kids is crazy. Like fuses are short. Like they, it, young kids like really do have guns. Like that shit is crazy. I don't want no problem with y'all, young. Hey, y'all out there, I don't want no problem with y'all, young. No, niggas, no, man. Yeah. Straight up. I'm tired, baby. <laughs> I just want to go home to the kids and just come on. It's now. a lot of things behind that that lead up to why them kids be acting like that too. You gotta mm. think maybe like the household that they're in, mm-hmm. the shit that they see, the music. The music music, the music play, always played a part. Yeah, it's always all the way back to I mean a long it ain't gonna time. Make everybody yeah. act crazy, but I shit. Just, 
Tupac had <laughs> niggas out here ready to, you know, shit. On Easy E got that. You feel me? All the, most of the music we listen to on the radio is they beef songs. Have you noticed that? They beef tracks got the most fucking uh, hits. Hits. That's the ones we know. That's the ones we're going to bop to in the club. That's it be fact. beef tracks they made. So did you guys um, hear, like, any of the Kanye interviews where he was saying, like, the Jewish the peoples are behind, like, uh, pushing this production of the very violent music? How do you feel about I, that? I, I heard that and I had listened. Uh, oh, did you hear about it? I did, I but I... don't really can say anything on that. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I'm about like that. That's my answer. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't. I, don't, I would I don't like know, to find out more. I would like to find yeah. out more. I, yeah. I would definitely have to do some research on the topic. Shit. He said that, but all the music we making got but all the, gangster right now. Shout out to Kanye. Shout out to Ye. Ye is not crazy. I don't think Ye he is, is not crazy. Yeah, I don't. He, think he just. You it's just on yay is just yay. <laughs> yay is just yay. Y'all got to understand. Back to what I said earlier. You got to understand it. Mm-hmm. That's it. He got them folks on his back. He got to do what he got to do. Exactly. You feel me? And we know who them folks is that's on his back. Yes, Lord. Right. And big loomies and whoever else. Like, so, hey. Cool. Man, y'all make sure y'all call in, man. Tell Devin why y'all choose to be single, why you're single, or why you like, hell no, I need I need somebody at my house. I need me a woman. I need me a man. Call into that call in number, man. We're going to post it for y'all. I want to know right why now. a lot of yes, these other women single. Definitely love to hear both who's single? sides. <coughs> Yo, who who is single out here? If you're single, call in right now and tell me why you're single. And please don't let your first answer because these niggas ain't shit, Snow. Let me tell you about these niggas, Snow. They ain't shit. I don't want to hear that shit. And then what are you attracting to? Yeah, what are like, you Like, are you attracting you, ain't shit You niggas? are what you... <laughs> 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 you are what you like, eat. How, how do you? How all your niggas ain't shit? Like I don't, I don't understand. That. <coughs> yeah, that's, damn, that's. I'm that's all very... about taking accountability. Ha, ha, taking accountability. And nice. I think too is the area. Have y'all ever like went to another state and like, like damn, like all these bitches bad in Texas. All these bitches yes, bad Lord. in Louisiana. Yeah, yes, we know. Like I, yeah. the, these niggas here, they're not for me. I'm, I'm so convinced. That I need to go to a It's like state. that. It's really like that. If for I'm real. gonna find a nigga that's like really <laughs> on my level, I just don't. I'm not seeing it here. You might have to. I, that's funny you said that because I said it too. I was like, damn, I'm gonna have to go somewhere different. Go overseas and cook. Yeah, oh my. I, I would right, definitely girl. love to go to another country and just go and just like date, just to date. Yeah, that, I feel that'd be dope though. That'd be dope. Yeah. Only, only, only single people can do this shit. For these viewers, only single people uh, can do this. Uh, right now, only single Man. people. Hey, so the right nigga, you feel like the right nigga ain't in North Carolina for you? Um, I feel like he's not in Cabarrus County. I'll put it like that. Uh, I don't know. Maybe not Mecklenburg either. Oh, call got a caller. Hey. Got a caller. Who, somebody holler at me now. Let's see who we talk to. Yo, yo, yo. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Ain't nothing, man. Shit, I'm, I'm going to get on that discussion, man, about about why we single out here, man. Nice. Go ahead. Let me know something. Man, listen, let me tell you something. It's a hard day to pool out here, man. You know what I'm saying? And I'm a, I'm, I'm a lesbian. I'm a stud. You know what I'm saying? I'm out here with the females, man. I'm going to tell you one thing. You know, these mugs, it seemed like within the first two weeks of you talking to them, there's always a bill or something coming up. It just be too soon. <laughs> it be too soon. Hey, hey, no, you ain't lying. <laughs> I ain't lying, hey. bro. Like, I mean, I ain't lying, man. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I know this one chick, man. Sweet as hell, man. She really is, man. But how you gonna hit me up talking about, you know, indirectly asking? That's the shit that pissed me off, too. I man. feel you. Shit. Indirectly asking. Oh, damn. You want something to eat? No, I don't want nothing to eat. I'm good. I drop y'all something. No, nah, don't worry about that. I'm good, Chuck. You oh, know what I'm saying? God. An hour later. Damn. Oh, what's wrong, baby? What's going on? You good? Damn, damn. Shit then came through my account. <laughs> Netflix. <laughs> what? <laughs> Netflix damn. came through. Like, right, what you, what you mean, bro? You man, know what I'm saying? Like, Netflix. Man, this funny as fuck. Man, next thing you know, man, I'm just... You know, we, we still chatting on the line and whatever. Come back. Shit. What's wrong? What's going on? You know what I'm saying? I forgot the kids got school pictures in my oh, shit. Yep. Right, Here damn. we go. Here we go. Here Every we time. Go. 
Every time she Every never time, fails, bro. bro. You ain't lying. I mean, but really be like cool people, you know what I'm saying? Be seeming like really cool people. And, you know what I'm saying, have good intentions. Mm-hmm. But next thing you know, they hit you, bro. It's yeah. always a light bill, you know what I'm saying, or something. They $98 you know? short on the light bill. Man, Come yeah. on, man. Damn. Come on, man. Just every time. Every time, bro. Every time. How? Yeah, man. How every time. So is that, that is crazy. that is that all females that's doing that to you? you Not feel? all. I won't say I won't say all. That's just an example. You know what I'm saying? I was, yeah. you know, giving one of the examples. I'll tell you, you know what I'm saying? Another thing, man. You know, we grown out here. We all have responsibilities. You know what I'm saying? Thanks. So <laughs> if you know, y'all know how rent then went up. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather be owning something. You know what I'm saying? I wanna I want to be on Devin, Devin level, you know what I'm saying? She seemed like she didn't got everything all, you know, figured out. She she didn't pay some things off. Did. She on a mission, right? You know what I'm saying? So yep. we, a lot of us grown folks is out here on a mission right now. We're trying to accomplish some things. But nonetheless, you know what I'm saying? I find some females who want to come and just hang out. You know what I'm saying? You smoke weed, they smoke weed too. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? They right. want to just hang out at your shit. They don't want to be productive. <laughs> Oh, bitch! You know don't what know what when to go home. Oh man! Yeah, you yeah. know what I'm saying. Like, you gotta get, get the, the fuck out of here. Out. You gotta get a fuck out. Come on, man! You know, just, oh, just man. not the hangout Beat spot. It. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You know, because then they want. They, then they, next thing you know, you know, they getting into it with their parents. You know, of course, they living with their parents right now to reestablish themselves, pay some bills off, so they can get down. You know, it's always a story. You know what I'm saying? And I appreciate that. But don't be trying to move in on the fly. You know what I'm saying? It's too weak. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you been talking for two weeks. Okay, Damn. so let me ask you a question. Were you were you sleeping with this person that asked you for this ninety eight dollars? Oh, it wasn't ninety eight dollars, but shit, it was forty dollars. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't oh, even ninety eight. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's just a fact. You know what I'm saying? But no, I was. You know what I'm saying? sleeping with this person, but this is a person that, I'm going to be honest with you, it's been on and off, you know, it's just one of those things, like I said, you feel like they have good intentions, and, you know, they're a sweet person, but I always try to get her where I feel like, you know what I'm saying, she, she on the rise, like, she can handle shit on her own, but every time I holler at her, or whatever the case may be, or we might reconnect, you know, it seems like I'm missing her at a bad time, here we go again, you need something within the you know what I'm saying? Next few days and shit like that. Yeah. You know, so yeah. I want to see some type of independent, you know what I'm saying, vibe in you, you know what I'm saying? And I don't, you know, I'm not a selfish person by no means, but come on, man. Like, we all out here trying to accomplish things. It's supposed to be a team effort. Mm-hmm. And, you know, you ain't dropping the positive you, you just withdrawing. That's right. true. That, that's true, right? Team effort. So, do you yeah. feel like if it if it was like three months down the line instead of like a couple of weeks or a couple of days, would that make you feel more comfortable? Oh, absolutely. I wouldn't even be thinking about it at that point. You know what mm. I'm saying? Right. I'm not even. You know, but at first, you know, I think as, as humans, whether you male or female, you're gonna have a little guard. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you're grown, you and your grown shit. You're gonna have a little guard. Right. You know what I'm saying? To protect your stuff. You know what I'm saying? That you gonna work hard for it to get to this place where you're ready to settle down with a person. Now that's you know understandable. What I'm yeah. That's understandable. So yeah. you you not out here gambling no more. You know what I'm saying? Like before, when you out here just moving around, then that's different. But mm-hmm. when you're trying to settle down with somebody, you trying to really see what their vibe is and whether or not this is genuine. Mm-hmm. That, that part, thank you. That's exactly what I was saying <clears throat> okay. earlier. If it's yeah. genuine, that's understandable. If it's genuine, you know what I'm saying? Because because I didn't put my money out there. Like old dude called and said, "Be checking out." We all, you know what I'm saying? For the most part, <laughs> <laughs> we didn't we didn't hear some shit. I didn't pay for some furniture. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Stand, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Not a TV stand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I bet yeah. that. Good shout out to the stand. <laughs> Miss TV was on yeah. the floor. Had yes, to sir. Lift it you up. know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. I done paid for the TV stand, man. Kitchen table. Kids yeah, got to eat, you know what I'm saying? Together. You, you know, be, be together. But at the end of the day, man, it's just when you get to that certain point and you're ready to settle down, then you don't want somebody that's just, you know what I'm saying, coming to take, 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 take. Because right. that's a red flag. you like, okay, what can you give to right. the situation? You know what I'm saying? You come out, come and hang over here. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're hungry. Shit. 
Mm-hmm. What's up? You know, so, what, what can you give to the situation? So what what is a, a, a good thing to give? Like, what could the ideal woman give to you? Besides the pussy. Besides yeah. pussy. <clears throat> Hey, I'm gonna be honest with you, man. Like it'd it be little things. You know, it's not even I think that we so uh used to using general statements like loyal, honest, trustworthy, things of that nature. But when we start to be with this person or even live with them, it'd be little things that be pissing us off. We ain't even think about loyalty or honesty. You know what I'm saying? It's nice. habits. You know, I had one chick nice. tell me in the beginning, she said, um, you know, I reason why me and such and such ain't work out because, you know, they don't clean up and, and their kids aren't as they don't make their kids responsible for cleaning up. So that's a red flag for me. Okay, uh, I got hey. you. So you like, you know, you like to be in a clean space, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, that makes sense. So this person is also asking me in turn, okay, are you, you know, a tidy person? Is that a third? I'm going to invite you to my space. You know, yeah, I keep my shit decent. Now we all have days when we might throw a shirt over the couch. We just ain't got it in it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, we but ain't we, that yet. we take care of our stuff. You know what I'm saying? Facts. But every time I notice, every time she leaves my apartment, even though you know where the trash can is, <laughs> your trash is still there. <laughs> I can't stand a nigga that'll walk back. That's a test for me. It don't even oh, go back to man. even get that motherfucker. Come on now. Like if I'm dating you and you leave my house, no. <laughs> Damn. Man. How you gonna have a standard for somebody to be clean and then when you over at somebody else shit, you, do you don't dirty. even throw your stuff away. Yeah. Oh man, that's you tough know what I'm right saying? There. Sheesh. <laughs> so, I appreciate- you know, when I'm yeah, man, when I'm looking for something with somebody, it's the little things like that. If you're going to talk about having a standard, okay, let me make sure that you follow it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, absolutely. 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 I appreciate that. You live by what you go by. I appreciate that. For sure. That's That's a big thing for me. You know, we can talk about the general things, but listen, a lot of people, what their expectations are and what they want, look good, but they know that they're not capable of having those things because deep down inside, they're not able able to provide those things. You know what I'm saying? So <clears throat> I feel like it's good as a woman if you want a man with a lot of money. But are you a hustler yourself? You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. are you willing to go and get the bag yourself? Shout out to Angie Blake. Whoever her husband is. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's a hustling person. You know what I'm saying? She in comments all day. This, that, and the third with her pieces of cake, her sweatsuit, all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I ain't never bought a piece of cake. But <laughs> <laughs> hey, you are, man. I love you, but, man, man. Look, man. Yeah, man. But she, she dope as hell, and I know that her husband can appreciate that. Even if I'm coming home and paying all the bills, when I'm all stretched out and thinned out, I know my girl got my back. You know, I know my wife got my back, and she's able to have that because she's out here hustling and getting her own. Even right. though I can, you know, what I'm saying take care of everything. Nice. So, you know, me personally, that's the type of person that I would, you know, I don't want you to have to work hard, break the fingernails and do all of that. But do you have some type of ump in you that if when I'm all, you know what I'm saying, done and dried out, you can have my back? I heard that. Man, we appreciate you that's calling me. in and you right. talking to us, man. Appreciate that. Yeah, we do appreciate it. Hey, man, straight up, man. <laughs> y'all continue to do what y'all doing, man. Thank you so yeah, much thank for the call. you. Be safe. All right, y'all. All right, peace. peace. Hey man, one. hey I'm glad they called man. Shit, yeah, hey, uh, that was good. That was good. That was good. That was good. I that had DJ Rev, DJ Relevant, finna walk up in here, man. I told that fool to be here at nine o'clock. He was DJ. We rock. Fifty three <laughs> minutes late, <laughs> but he here, y'all. I think too. Um, something else I would like What's to happening? touch bases on. Please touch is that base. Like. Being able to be comfortable with what you walked into a relationship with. Like, don't uh, let a nigga change your life for getting slapped around. Uh, Ooh, yeah, like, because he done bought you all this shit. Like, you need to be y'all. able to. Yeah. Mashed potatoes again. <laughs> 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 I don't know. Your <laughs> yeah, like, come come in what you oh, willing to man. leave with. Don't, don't let a nigga change you your my, lifestyle. Yeah, tighten then up. you're going to be girl. scared to leave. I can't leave this nigga. Cause tighten the fuck up. Gucci shoes. I be telling y'all this. I be like, man, come on. How do y'all be letting it go down? Like, how? yeah. How? Yeah. 
Because yeah, people have a financial hold over people. People done <laughs> elevated them. Like, uh, you're not coming here elevating shit. I'm already where I want to uh, be. How many people <laughs> you know in a relationship right now, just in a relationship for just to be, to pay half of their bills? Financial reason. They can't leave here. They gonna be, they ain't got nowhere to go. I ain't shit. Back in the day, like, you know, aunties and grandmothers used to marry people based off that fact. And they'll fall that's in love true. with them yeah. later. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. That is true. true. Like, shit, I, I don't really know if I love them, but he took good care of me and my kids. Like, you know, love a, didn't, wasn't always a, an option yeah, that's a for fact. people that's in the past. Fact. However, today, um, hey, however, today, I, I feel like, you got know, DJ relevant in here, man. Have some love. We got a DJ relevant yeah. just walked in the building, man. We're gonna get him on the podcast. Oh, yeah, nah, Take a seat nah, and pass a beer. <laughs> Take a seat and pass you a beer. Co- you gonna be catching contact. This man oh. done brought a pack in here. Podcast when it get good. Now nah, I was quiet. Shit, this man don't came with Corona. I want one. <laughs> Shout oh, out to right. DJ get Red. Right, I love Corona. <laughs> Shout out, ooh, shout out to DJ Real. Go ahead and get in this good, camera, bro. man. Go ahead and get on here, man. Shit. Let me get My man, what's good? Shit, man. We're going to let him get straight real quick, man. Boy. Man, my hand I'm jittery. What the fuck wrong with me? You got to tighten up. Have you eaten? <laughs> I haven't. That's I'm, why. I'm jittery in here. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> Walked in the motherfucking building, man. Shout out to that man, Red. What's happening? What's going on, what brother? Man, I appreciate you showing up. Shit, uh, we didn't think he's gonna make it. <laughs> I told y'all I was coming. Hey, that's why I fuck with you, man. Yeah, it ain't Modelo, but we gonna drink this motherfucker like it's Modelo. Oh, bet. Oh, yeah, I passed. It. I love oh, Coronas. Bet, bet. <clears throat> Y'all got the the niggas with the shakiest hands trying Shout to open the damn Mandela. beer right. Hey, now. but you doing that motherfucker though? Trying my best, man. My daddy always told me, get all I got. That's right, as you said. Real, man, the topic today, man, De- Devin talking to us. The topic. Okay. She was saying, um, choosing to be single and successful at the same time. Choosing to be single. Real, you single? You got a woman? Ah, so never mind. Hold on, hold on, no, 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 no. Let don't hit that, that button. Don't that hit that question. button. Go ahead, yeah, go, go ahead. ahead. He had to just adjust himself. Don't hit that right. button. Yeah, right. Because I've been nigga. saying I've been single for a long time, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you have. Somebody got my attention. Ooh. Hey, hey yo. Hey, shout out to you, baby. I don't know if you watching or not. I'm glad That's you got this nigga That's attention, man. It's hard. It's hard to get a keep a man to get a man's attention and keep it because you can get it just by looking half naked. With, I'm telling you. You know how I many goddamn females don't pass me and real? I'm like, real, 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 real. <laughs> Look at that ass. Goddamn, boy. Cook God almost. She thicker than a ref- refrigerator Christ- Rice crispy treat around. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Most definitely. But yeah. your, my attention gone from you that quick. I ain't even worried about you no more, baby. We don't right. see your little see through dress. We don't see your little mm-hmm. ass out. We see your ass out every fucking day. We ain't worried about you no more. Like, we ain't worried about you no more. Class. Post it. I see yeah, them, like. No 25 <laughs> millimeter big blinks looking good, baby, but we ain't worried about you no more. For real. Tell me. You were single for a long time. This right person came around. What was the quality she had that these other ladies didn't have? That's what I want to know. Mm. Oh, we, we, oh, we got a call. Okay. We're gonna let you talk about that. Say that question. Okay. Call up number three. Holla at me. <laughs> Never mind. They ain't pay the bill, y'all. God damn it. Pay your fucking phone bill, y'all. Call Come on dropped. now. Come on now. So unfortunate. Real, go ahead and answer that question. Mm-hmm. What what she had different that the other ladies didn't have? I'm gonna call them bitches. Nah, I'm fucking. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Nah, I'm fucking nah. with you. <laughs> Caller number three, you there? Hello. What's happening? What's the What's the topic for today? <laughs> Brother God, Mitri. I know who that is. Man, nigga, it's the peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> it's the peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 Mitri, chick on here told me, God damn, do you still want to get your ass ate, man? She said she was ready, man, boy. Man, bro. Who? What she look like? Man, I'm, I'm going to say, I don't want to put it out like that, but I'm going to send her shit to your inbox. Hey, y'all got your ID, cuz? Why you don't need no ID? This nigga at work. Man, hang nigga, up the fuck. Man, hang up the phone yeah. on that nigga, man. <laughs> man, that's goddamn Mitri, man. Y'all follow that work. nigga. No. Mitri. No, I don't either. Yo. 
Man, we hanging up on you. Y'all ain't telling me the topic for today, man. Y'all got to tell me the topic the, for today. The, the, the topic is choosing to be choosing to be single and successful at the same time. Singly successful. Singly successful. That's a must. Successful. That's a must. That's a must. That's a must. Nigga, is you single? <clears throat> I don't remember you being single. I'm very single, bro. Come on, man. I, I, who eating your ass then if you single, god damn it? Is this my, a real thing? My thought. Oh, but well, my bad. Shout out to her, man, because <laughs> hey, she she taking care of brother. Hey, boy, she's strong, boy. She taking care of him. Taking care so, of my man. What so, she say? Getting them right. Like, Why you choosing right. to be single, man? Go ahead and tell us that part. Because these hoes ain't shit. Of course, mm-hmm. that would be your answer. <laughs> <laughs> what make these hoes not be shit, man? What, what make them not be shit? Like, it's they actions, man. It's all about. It start with their mama. I haven't, I haven't found one that I feel like it's worth me being faithful to. Facts. What they be doing, bro? What they do? Is it hard for you to be faithful? Nah, it ain't hard. It ain't hard to please me, man. That's 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 sad because I'm an easy person to please. Before you leave, give us five things right now you need in a relationship to to keep your attention and and to please you, as you say. Give me five things. Trust one. Trust. Uh huh. Communication. Two. Some fire top. Hey, <laughs> Damn, hey, nigga, that should have been number one, nigga. No <laughs> cap. That should have been fucking number one. Nah, nah, that's number three. That's number three. Mm-hmm. Four. She gotta be a hustler. She gotta have the same hustle mindset that I got. Mm-hmm. Cause I'm not taking care of nobody. Mm-hmm. And and five. She she can't beat them fuck none of my homeboys. That's it. That ain't that ain't a bad. That ain't too hard. Yeah, that ain't. Hey, head should have been number that one. That last one got them kind of kind of hard to deal with. Hang out with the right homeboys. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta have. You gotta have. Hey, that last right. one is a hey, hold, hold on, man. Hold on. We gonna we gonna bring this to so we gonna bring y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Man. We gonna put your glasses up in the air right now, man. <laughs> Shout out to all them hoes out there, man. Y'all been doing this shit for a long time, long baby. Time. Y'all been doing this shit for a long time. Y'all keep America great. Lord, meet you, man. We appreciate you calling in. Nigga. Get back to work, you man. Already shout out to everybody on the panel. Already, bro. You already know. Thank nigga. you. Thank you. Salute. My man. Be safe, bro. Y'all too, ladies. This is my advice for y'all. If y'all want to keep y'all nigga, eat his ass. Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> He said, "If you ain't eating ass, you don't get a pass at all." Real, we back on you, man. What, good, what, my brother. What did yeah. this this woman had that these other ladies didn't had the, the, the major one? Talk about fuck the with. qualities. On that, on that, she got patience, and understanding. You she me? had patience and understanding. Good that what I said, hey boy. You know, I told you that Saturday when I seen you at the thing. I said, boy, you know where I went. Patience and understanding. Oh, hey, 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 and, and she didn't let her. <clears throat> Friends get in her ear. That's the best. Okay. You know Was her friends telling like some friends bad be stuff arch about enemies. It? Nah. Her okay. friends was with it. See what I'm saying? You know how y'all be there. Some he, of the she, friends. He a DJ. He got out of home. Man, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's. That's what they okay. be saying. Okay, okay. See, that's the myth about it. Mm-hmm. You got all the hoes. You don't have all the hoes, man. Because. They all Sorry. think you get all the hoes. They all think you got all yes, the hoes. And I be like, where the fuck are they at? Right. Yes, where Lord. they at? I'm right you know what I'm saying? I don't, what time I got? You know you that I'd rather you chase a bag than chase that. a female. Okay. So thank that's you. just me. I'm telling you. Like, oh, you don't pick up your phone. Thought I was feeling you? I'm you know, busy. I'm busy. You, you don't text me back. Um, I'm busy. I'm busy. That shit aggravates the hell out of me. I'm busy. And, and yes, if oh. I really fuck with you like that, I'm going to hit you back when yeah. I'm able to. Right. And I feel like, you know, right. the one I'm right. dealing with, she be busy too. Ain't and that's that a the plus? thing about it. That's a plus. That's what keeps y'all She getting coming. a bag. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. She ain't waiting for me just getting a bag. She getting a bag too. Facts. Right. You know what I'm saying? So she ain't just waiting around for me to come home or whatever the case may be. She's sitting around just doing anything or... Just waiting to do anything with our homegirl. She getting a bag too. Right. Mm. She let me know, yo, I'm doing it. I'm doing this too. Okay. What Absolutely. time? I, I schedules. Da 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 da. We tell each other. I she busy. I'm busy. Mm-hmm. Let's get the bag together. Mm-hmm. That's what it is. That's exactly how together. it should be. And there's no complaints <clears throat> because we have understanding. We getting the bag. 
Real, how important is sex in that new relationship? Oh, sex you? is very important. I don't give a fuck. Let <laughs> 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 oh, me get to it. Give sex me, is give me a percentage, one through a hundred. How about what's the percentage? How how important it is? You got to be at least a ninety or better. God damn, you got you got to be. I God should. damn, I always say I'm in 80, my. But yeah, if you don't I'm know, a, if you don't know, I'm in my thirties. Okay. So you got, I ain't got time to be teaching nothing. (laughs) You got to know it. You got to know it. Yes, Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, shout out to all y'all out there, man. Shout out to all y'all that know how to use it. Hey, shout out to them. You got to know it. Hey, yo, no. Jay Adam, this is the clip note you get right here. This is the clip you know it. Shout out to all y'all that know how to do that little fucking. Kegel Kegel, thing with your fucking oh my god! Shout out to all the ladies out there that know how to do that Kegel squeeze, clenching the muscle. That sounds like yeah, yeah. Y'all help keep America great, crazy boy. boy, Bless their heart. Boy, what? (laughs) God, that's exercise, ain't it? I I had a chick tell me one time, right? Yeah, I had a chick tell me one time she used to Kegel thirty minutes a day, say keep that thing tight. Yeah. It's a muscle. You have Good. to you have to lie. work your muscles. Mm-hmm. Keep them in shape. Show I'm gonna start asking, bitch, how much you kegel, girl? <laughs> 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 oh, I was in the gym the other day. I hit about fifty. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> that thing ready. <laughs> What's your kegel rip? Look at that. that yeah, work ready. them kegels like you doing them fucking butt squats, bitch. That God, ready. Damn man, shout out to y'all out there that's kegeling, man. It, you said what? He said that squeeze. Oh shit! <laughs> but goddamn, <laughs> what she do? What else do she need? Nah, for hey, real. hey, and bless the ones that look you in the eyes, and and squeeze at the same. You ain't shit, Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> boy. You ain't shit. I believe she's working with a whole lot. Say, look me in my eyes. eyes. Look you in your eyes and kegel that thing at the same time. Yeah, boy. Hey, you are a fucking. A demon. Who? What's your mama name? Let me look you. I got my eye on you, bitch. I'm talking about my good eye too now. <laughs> shit. <laughs> shit. What the good hell? God. Hey, yeah. So that's, back to you being <coughs> single. That's right, though. Yeah. So clearly, I should have asked you this the first time. You kept her because she can kegel and look you in the oh, eye. Oh no, nah, it's same. not just that. <laughs> nah, it's not. It's not. It's not no, mentally. It's more than sex. Mentally. I'm fucking with you. She got you, can get, you can get sex, man, from damn near any woman. That's damn like, right. You know what I'm saying? Like that's right. It's it's a pleasure for people. You know what I'm saying? So mm-hmm. if, if that's what somebody want at that time, that's what they're gonna get. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Right. Like we grown. If that's what exactly. we want, that's what we want. Bottom if that's mind. what we establish, yeah, we gonna that's what it's boom, gonna be. boom, boom. That's what we gonna do. That's yeah. what it is. You know what I'm saying? But when you find more than that, it's like it's like yo, keep coming around. I like picking what up you the doing. phone call. I like yes, what you're doing. Make sure you hit like me how, when you. Hey, <laughs> I like how you talk to me. See, you know in the grocery store. Damn, real. Who got you smelling like this? Why you smelling like this? Man? You been walking around with a red sunshine. Who got you smelling like this? My boy. Jeez. That's what I'm doing, man. So, salute, real. What salute. you telling me is you taking this serious? This ain't no fling. This you you um, feeling this? Definitely, definitely. Um, something I'm gonna look into. Definitely something, um, cause I ain't no spring chicken. I ain't gonna lie. Still yeah. So yeah. like, yeah. niggas getting old now. Can't keep playing Jeez. out here. Like, and these females, like they on they on demon time. Most of these females, like, they be saying the niggas on demon time. Jeez. They be red. City girls got these bitches fucked up. Oh man, these females on, on demon. Nah, it's past man. city girls. Are these bitches want to be JT? Look at that. Well, yeah. they be on yeah. demon time from a mile they away. They just be. Mine fucking, I fucking, you be like, ah, Well, I'm proud of you, man. I got my face back. Yeah, you know, I didn't have my face back. I didn't see, I didn't think yeah, you had it in you, though. goddamn. I Cause. thought you weren't going to be shit till you I die. I want that. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'll fuck with you, though, for real. I, I feel you on that, real. I'm kind of on that same shit. You know, I did my shit when I wanted to have 12 hoes at one time, and I did my shit when I wanted to have... The 24 hoes at one time, shit. Different hoes Whichever day. one. But... God put his hands on me. Okay. And I had to have a few life experiences to let me know why I need a good woman in my life. Then I started looking at all the niggas that got real bread. They got a good woman. 
with him. Right. And she helping him keep that bread and get that right. bread. I was saying Cardi B doing all this shit for Offset and so on. I'm like, man, you know what? I need me a goddamn good ass like that. woman. Yeah. I she need to accept me for me. Baby, this is what you're going to get. That part. <clears throat> We're going to pray and help God that part. mold each. Ho- help, hope that God mold me to be the man you want me to be and vice versa. That's the type of shit I'm on. Mm-hmm. You know, I ain't the perfect man by far, but am right. I willing to try and get right? Mm-hmm. Damn right. right. I do whatever it takes to get right. That part. True indeed. So that's how I'm feeling about that. Uh, Ray, I'm glad you came in for real. Appreciate it. I, I think you're going to make it, boy. Yeah. You know? I'm glad you made it. I told you I was coming. That's why I fuck with you, man. This it turned out to be a good show. I know it's going to be a good show with Lil' Cuz, Dev, Dev anyway, man. Dev, okay. you know, she she hit That's me with the, the topic. That's right there. Hey, she hit me with yeah. the topic, and I'm like, hey, yo, we got to run. We're going to rock with yeah, it. We're going to run with that. Yes, I hit I up like T. Too. I like it. Let me tell y'all about T. Like T it. always been that nigga. It don't matter what the fuck I'm doing. I can say, T, I'm finna go to fucking Dollar General real quick to get some socks. I'll be like, what you doing? he be like, shit, that. niggas, let's ride. That's my dog. <laughs> Last time I seen this nigga was at Dollar Tree. You hey, remember that? I swear to <laughs> God, it was. <laughs> Every it time. Was. Hey, no, shout you will randomly see me with this nigga, and it's just because I hit him be like, hey, bro, I ain't want to ride by myself. You all right? He be like, shit, let's ride. Now let's ride. Now I'm going to Durham this week. Shit, man. Let's, let's ride. Let's do it. <laughs> hey, hey, you yo, all going? Let me tell you something. I be out anywhere. I see T. Yo. He be by himself. Yeah. I see T. All the time. I be telling you. I'm by, by myself. myself. Mm-hmm. We click up. We together the whole night. We chilling. We vibing. We watching the whole crowd, yep. the movement, all that. Yep. T always been like a stand up guy to me. You know I walk up with him, man. Only way I know how to be, man. I that can't be fake with. and phony. It's just bro. like you, Snow. You always been a stand up guy. You know what I'm saying? I talk a lot of shit, though. You, you talk a lot of shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I'm not. That's him. Yeah, I talk a lot of shit, man. I'm not, salute you know, the salute social media type, like these mm-hmm. gentlemen here. Like, you know what I'm saying? I post what I post sometime and. I'm gone. You might not see me post nothing for a little while. You know what I'm saying? I'm, right. I'm not that type. I post entertainment, post where I be at, whatever. But these guys keep me entertained. Right. You, try, you know yeah. what I'm saying? They do. They keep me entertained. And like, nah, that's a fact, though. Because you know, he tell me that when I see him. He do. Yeah. Try, like, <laughs> like, they keep yeah. me entertained. Shout out to y'all. Every y'all time bros, I see man. Tony I post, y'all. I know it's going to be some funny shit. Tony, <laughs> Tony shit, what have you. I know the fuck he just did. And did. <laughs> Yeah, it be like I the country know. photos for You me. know what I'm like saying? With the shorts hey, and shit. Yeah, hey. he be going, he be going man. crazy. Red, Stupid. I get to eating Red Bull, uh, drinking beer, smoking weed. Boy, my mind just boom. I just turned into a market. Yeah, out here. I ain't playing. <laughs> I start yeah. putting on a wig, yeah. singing a song. Daisy Deuce. Hey, it, what? It, I don't know what God gonna bring to me. That's what I that do. Shit, yeah, because I really. Hey man, like matter of fact, before we get out of here, music on platforms, man. Oh, yeah, you feel me? Go follow me, man. Instagram, Big Burner, B U R, two N's and an A underscore 704. Follow me, man. You feel me? Burner Alexander on the book. Add me and shit. Tap in. Awesome. Tap in. Awesome. Tap in. Oh, yo. And also, um, say that, man. Shout out to Meg, man. This Saturday, um, Hattie, man. it's the grand opening Vibes Lounge in Kannapolis. It's where Jackie Boys used to be at. So, okay. You know, now, Bob. who owns the new place? Um, that's, oh, that's not. Oh, okay. That's, that's, <laughs> I heard like, the last right. guy sold it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he sold it. Yeah, it's that's sold. why I was asking. Just I, know it's sold, but we're not putting that out there. Just oh, okay. know who running this show is Kareem and Rail at Vibes Lounge Saturday. This Saturday for the grand opening. Come out, have a good time. You know what I'm saying? If you pop out, you might meet the owner. You never know. You might know. Okay, cool. I, yeah, I, I wasn't tripping. You I just, never I know. Didn't, I, I met the last owner. He was a nice guy. So I was yeah, just surprised yeah, he yeah, sold yeah, it. Yeah, That's yeah, all. Yeah, he, yeah, he nice. was cool. You know what I'm saying? But you still might see a couple old faces that worked there. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, kept them along. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, you never know. Shout out to Vibes. You know what cool. I'm saying? Yeah. Why we're on Not the, the one in Salisbury, the one in Concord, Please. Concord, Please Concord Kannapolis, right. the yeah. one right there, yeah. Boy, we bringing it back right. home, you hear me? Yeah. Hey, listen, y'all missed 1903, you know, some mishaps <laughs> happened in 1903, we ain't going to get into all of that, it ain't got yeah. nothing to do with none of us, but we bringing the flavor back, you know what I'm saying? And with 1910, 
If you was there last weekend, you know it was a vibe. Oh, absolutely. Shout out to Host 111. She? My brother owns the building. I was uh, there. You were okay. doing your shits, okay? You I? Yeah. I hope you DJing <laughs> like that at Vops, because that shit was hot. It was a it was a crazy party. Let's just say shout that. Shout out, shout out to that. Shout out, man. Shout I appreciate all that. y'all tuning in right now. Everybody oh, yeah. watching everybody. Oh, we got watching. hold on, hold on. We got T Burner performing. For the grand opening too. Okay, well, nice. You hear me? He me like I I, I he gotta throw like I gotta that. throw that out there. That's pretty lit. We got T Burner performing, man. So if you ain't never seen him perform, come catch that energy. I'm telling like you, we it. got hookah, we got good food, we got liquor, we got sections. Gotta add it's, that a liquor, baby. it's a vibe. It's a vibe. It's a vibe, and you never know where you might catch me, cause I'm everywhere. I'm not just in one spot. I'm everywhere, so it ain't no telling where you going to catch me at. Shit I could be was in the crazy. city there you. Man, awesome. I do. Like I said, I appreciate everybody tuning in and watching right now. Look, call in to the call in number. We're going to post it one more time. Holla yeah, at Devin in. before we get up out of here. Devin, yeah. the topic Devin came up with, she said, choosing to be single, man. Tell me why y'all single. And shit, if you married, single. if you married, she'd call in to tell me why you damn married. What made you yeah. not want to be single no more and get married? I want to hear it all, goddammit. Also, while we're waiting on a caller, I just want to go ahead. While we're talking about grand openings, I will be opening my new nail salon mm. December 1st. You know what I'm saying? Good. You know what I'm saying? 109 Somebody Corbin call. Avenue. Somebody uh, Corbin Avenue. I mean, I don't know. Somebody shit laugh. Everybody hit volume, baby. Everybody hit your volume. Yeah, mine down. Turn it down. We back. My okay. bad, yo. <laughs> yo, 109. <laughs> Corbin <laughs> Avenue. We're across the street. I'm across the street from Barbra Scotia, uh, um, where the Ice Plant Plaza is, right there beside the car wash. Um, this is going to be the ultimate nail experience. I'll be featuring different teas weekly for mind, body, and soul healing. Um, as everybody knows, I do full sets, manicures, pedicures. I could pretty much do whatever I see. So you guys are more than welcome to bring me your craziest designs or, you know, at the at the very least, we're going to keep your nails very, very healthy. I focus a lot on natural nail health. Um, I reconstruct toenails for the men uh, working hey. very hard and yeah, your steel yeah. toe boots. You got uh, ingrown toenails. Like, let me get them out for you. Sure. Hold on. Hold on. Now. Whoever that was, women. man, call back. My bad. You got some women with them. Yes, hey, I'm gonna have to get you to work on my pinky toe, boy. I stood yeah. that motherfucker on the bed one time, boy. Uh, motherfucker still yeah, retarded. Yeah, retarded. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> motherfucker still retarded. Since yeah. then, oh. call the number there four. Holla at Let's me. Do it. Call the number four. You gotta turn your volume down. It's like the radio, baby. Holla at me, though. <laughs> hey, what's happening? Tiana. Uh, what's happening? Hey, sis. You doing all right? Hi, sister. Hi, everybody. Hi, What's y'all. What's happening? What's happening? What's going on? Let us know why you single or take it. So, for me, mm-hmm. um, I'm single. Mm-hmm. For me, it's with the this, with this generation of guys, consistency and communication is, like, non-existent. And that's, like, super big for me. Like, guys do not know how to be consistent. They mm-hmm. start off good. You meet them. They start off good. Um, good communication, they'll call, you know, you're linking, you're hanging out, you're vibing, and all of a sudden it just goes, like, downhill. And it's like, I'm not sure if it's like you're not interested or whatever the case may be, but it's like the consistency is just not there. Like, guys get gone, get missing, they pop back up, and it's like, it's crazy. The the females do the same thing, though. Mm. Mm. That's true. I'm not, I'm, and that's not my argument. My argument is not that we don't do that, but I'm just saying for me, I'm thinking for Kiana. That's why I'm. That's that's why I'm single, and I will remain single until someone can be consistent. Because that's big for me. Like I'm not going to. I'm lay gonna answer down. your question right now. Huh? I'm gonna keep it blunt with you. Okay. When he do that, you ain't the one. Simple that's as it. that. It's just you ain't the one. That's why he did. Any, let me tell you something. A man gonna when you got a man interest, or when a a woman is interested in a man, 
they gonna be consistent. You hear me? That's they're gonna true. be. That's they're true. gonna be. It's gonna be mutual. The feeling yeah, is gonna be. Everything is natural. You shouldn't have to force nothing. So the feeling is gonna be mutual. When you interested, you interested. Ain't no half stepping. That means after the sex, because <laughs> you know sometimes, you know, either or it happens to us too as men, or it happens to a woman. I, I mean, I ain't going to say that because, you know. But anyway, it's either or. They're going to be interested or they're not going to be interested after the sex or after the date and whatever the case may be. Mm -hmm. But let me tell you this, right? Sometimes people don't tell you everything. They don't come clean when they dealing with you. So you could be a rebound on the low and don't even know it. That's the you see what I'm saying? Like, but that's you the could, problem too, though. But that's the problem. It's an issue. Why it's not an be issue. real? That's the, exactly. That's the issue. They Why can't not keep it real. They look, can't. Look, this is my thing. This is my thing. As as grown adults, it is your right to be able to date. When you're a dating and you're not in a committed situation with anybody, you are free to date whoever you want to. So mm-hmm. why not be honest with all the parties involved? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you got yeah, free. Yeah. I will let anybody, I will let anybody know. I will, you hear I will me? let but, anybody know that I'm dating. Look, you are not the only one. I ain't going to let you think you are. because you. It's, it's not. not even being the only one. It's just uh, that they, uh, didn't, they didn't get over that one. Yeah. You hear me? Mm-hmm. So... So, they might be case, filling the void. Okay, I so know. In that case, you should be open. You should be even more honest because now you start to play with people's feelings and emotions. And why, in your mind, you just trying to get over somebody else. Somebody can really be like really feeling you and putting their heart and their time on the line. And in your mind, you like, bitch, this ain't going no fucking way. Like I'm just trying <laughs> to get to the next side. Yeah, like feel, you start fucking with people's feelings and emotions. When you don't keep it real and keep it funky with people. Right. Like, that's mm-hmm. just, I'm a very open and real, and I'm a very real person. I don't play with feelings and all that other bullshit. Look, I'm going to let you know what it is. You ain't going to never have to think or wonder what Kiana on because I'm going to be open and up front. It is what it is. I'm not interested in settling down. I'm not interested in no commitment. I'm having fun. And if it's Tom today and Harry Friday, that's what the fuck it is. And that's the thing. And, and see, that's the thing. That. Hey, listen, and that's that. the thing. Let me tell you something, right? Let me tell you something about DJ Rail, right? That's the thing. I was single. I ain't going to hold you. So everybody, so we can stop the rumors and all that bullshit, whatever the fuck you hear. You know what I'm saying? Let me tell you something. Let me put it on the table. I was Go single, ahead, and I would tell them, look, I'm single. I'm not looking for nothing. Mm. You, hear mm-hmm. what they, you hear me? That's what they said. Oh, that's fine. I'm good. Just going with the flow. But right. Let me hear you something. Let me tell you something. And it's not to toot my ho- this not to toot my own horn. <laughs> real. It's not to toot my own horn. But I don't know no other way but to show if you fucking with me, I don't know no other way but to show love. Yeah. Mm. Show right. you a good time. I don't know no other way. I'm with you. So man. that reels the men. Right every time. And they thinking it's more than what it is. But it's not. And I, I tell them from the beginning. With them tough. I tell them from, I'm not looking for nothing. Yeah, nah. But in they head, let me tell you something. Some of these females in they head, oh, fuck what that nigga say. That's my boyfriend. Nigga, we go together. We oh, go together. Man. Real, real bad. bad. Real 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 bad. Yo, like, fuck what you say. Nigga got a whole girlfriend and three kids. You're like, damn, when did Nigga, I know yeah, about this we shit? We go together. <laughs> when was you going to tell God me? Damn. Just spit it by my right. mouth. When was you going to tell me this? Like, right. Man, I, feel, <laughs> I got a question for you. How long? You said they don't, they, they ain't consistent. How long do that consistency last in your book? Like a certain amount of days? Certain, is it weeks, months, um, a week? A week. Well, I'm not really speaking like for myself. I, I mean, I'm just I'm just having a topic because it's like oh, okay. when I get in a, when I get in a group with like my homegirls, we just all talk about different things, and we can meet a guy, and it may be going good for a month, it may be going good for three or four months, but it's like somewhere along the line that it becomes inconsistent. So I can't mm. really put a time frame on it because you know it just it just varies. Let me. Um, see. Huh? Let me see. 
Okay, let me speak on the consistency. Uh, I think a lot of times men will be different with their consistency in order to get your attention or of in course. order to get your conversation. Uh, and then no. once they get comfortable, like, nigga, you can't stop the dates. Mm-hmm. We can't stop the whatever we doing, away, the yeah, trip. So, well, yeah, you mm-hmm. got to keep coming with it. Don't think because you, yeah. you had the pussy three, four times. You could just go <laughs> yeah. lapse a day. Cut out if we out. You just said lapse a day. <laughs> no, like you need to keep the energy. Like, if you <laughs> expect that, for me to keep all this together, be with two, what's up? Say less. But, Devin, but that's like me and you. Like, we've had the conversation plenty of times. Like, this generation of guys do not know the real meaning of dating. Like, mm-hmm. okay, I've been, I just got a, a 10 year relationship um, and I've been single for two years. So the whole dating scene from 10 years ago versus now is so different. But at the very root, people should be able to like know how to just cordially date. And they don't. Like, I can, t- in the two years I've been single and the guys I have, you know, went out with or entertained or whatever, I can't. I can't remember them picking up the phone and say, you know what? Let's do dinner Friday night. Let's do this Friday night and you be ready, whatever. Like, that's a date. Like, niggas don't do that shit no more. Like, I can't, like, even even with talking to my homegirls, like, no, none of us are, like, getting, like, courted and dated, like, back in the day. You know what I'm saying? Like, when I talk to my grandmother and my grandfather and my aunts and my uncles, they, 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 husbands and their wives or whatever, they dated each other. And they dated for a long time because in that dating process, you really get to know that person. It's nice. like we jump from like, we meet you, we hang out a few times, and you either knock the fuck up with a baby or y'all boyfriend and girlfriend, real baby. <laughs> like, okay. it's yeah. no dating phase. Hey, it's no dating phase. Yeah. Like, how can you, people, like, think about it. It's no dating phase. And the people, women don't have no standards. People, people don't have no patience with each other. But first that's a argument, problem, though, because how yeah. can, first situation, or first time somebody, oh girl, you know, or a nigga come up to his boy, yo, yo, my nigga, you know, la la la, this and third, you, when people find out y'all mess with each other, they're gonna throw a wrench. Mm-hmm. Especially if it's some local shit, motherfuckers be jealous. Yeah. Motherfuckers yeah, be time. jealous. Yeah, they're like, damn, I ain't like, how the, the hell? How, how he get that? But yeah, yeah, how, yeah. How, 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 yeah. Be jealous because they can't jealous. fuck with jealous. the people you fucking with. How she? But the thing how is, she get that's him. why. Oh. But that's How why the dating part is so important. But that's why the dating part is so important because no matter what anybody say, you got to know people for your own self. And that goes for anything. But that's people, business. That's relationship. And let me tell you something. Let me tell you, you something. You don't, on your own. you don't have that. You don't have that. So that's why it takes a strong mind to be with a strong mind because you don't have that. Social media yeah. around the world. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. it's so no... So piggyback on the... Right. It's so no time. You question. see you see the bitter ones every day. Oh. The okay. bitch can have them. Yeah. I didn't <laughs> have them last night. <laughs> this down right. the third. Right. La, la, la. <laughs> yeah. like, she was whoa. little yeah. did she know. Yeah. Like you was just a little cigarette. That's it. Yeah. Puff puff yeah. put out. Oh, a little Newport. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's it, little Newport. Take a hit off the bill. <laughs> you call a little Newport. Get a short. God. Shut up. Let me do it up. Hey, bro, let me get your Stay short. Crazy. God damn. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> but you got to... When you dealing yeah. with somebody and you going wholeheartedly for them, like, I got to have that mutual understanding to know that, like, motherfuckers going to hate or whatever the case may be, but... When you know that's that somebody for you, they're gonna be consistent. Yeah, it's not going it's slow. Up. And, it's, and it's vice versa. You listen. Mm-hmm. Let me tell you, ladies, something. You can't expect the man to be consistent to you, and you ain't consistent to him. Well, I you was about me? to say that. I was about to say that because that's the thing too. Because a lot of times, like when we, when women are expressing ourselves, we're not downplaying. Like, we know bitches be out here on some old bullshit, and we know that these hoes be out here acting crazy. Like, I'm not yeah, saying, I'm do. not saying it's a, I'm, yeah, I'm not saying that because I, I know that's, that's, a, that's, that's fact. But what I am saying is that, um, if I, if I'm requiring, like, I can, I can give what I'm also requiring. That's right. just me. 
Right. Whatever I'm bringing, whatever I want somebody to bring to the table with dating me, trust and believe, I can bring in my own damn mm. self. Mm. Matter of right, fact, yeah. I ain't bringing right. nothing. Matter of fact, I'm not bringing nothing to the table. I'm gonna bring the table itself. Hey, okay, hey, like, that's what's hey, 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 the table. Let them know. You bring the table. I'm gonna bring the goddamn seat. Exactly, and that's just the energy. And that's the energy I'm on. And that's not on even no. That's not no bragging. That's not no old just talking bullshit. I'm for real. I am not at 33 years old. I'm grown as hell. I'm not requiring anybody to do anything for me that I can't do for my fucking self exactly. or do for that person and reciprocate. Thanks. So I so when you talk about, oh, I want a nigga to date me and say, guess what? I can tell that nigga to look, be dressed. I'm taking you to Ruth Chris because I can do that. So okay. at the same way, the same way I'm requiring him to date me and court me, I can do the same thing. So to <laughs> piggyback on the question, I'm going to remain single. Until that energy is reciprocated. And then so niggas can be consistent and have communication and learn how to actually date and get to know a person, then I'm going to just be hey, single. Kiana, hey, Kiana. Yeah. What, Boo Daddy? Why it had to be Ruth Chris, though? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> hold on. Let's go back. Nigga, Damn. your name. What you want, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did y'all hear that? You want Longhorn? Did y'all hear that? Hey, hold on, I'm hold on. Long Time out, Devin, hold up. Longhorn is good. What's wrong if hold you want to take you to over Longhorn? Hold on, T-Burner. T-Burner, hold up. Your name wasn't T-Burner just now. What she call you, Ooh, Ooh, Daddy. Daddy. Don't be putting my bitch on the spot right. like that. Well, hold on. She said it. Ooh, Daddy. I hey, I, have a, I got a couple booze out here. Hey, what you need and to a do? Couple baby you mama need to save for her. Real? You need to save her name in your phone as IKEA. Nigga, she bringing the table. <laughs> to <you>. <laughs> <laughs> y'all want <laughs> a motherfucking? I told her I'ma bring the chairs. I know that shit. No. Right. <laughs> uh, you crazy, light skin. Ooh, it's Yo, getting hot crazy. in here. Wow. I know that's right. Nah. Bad. But it go both ways, <laughs> sweetheart. Like in today's <laughs> in today's world, Damn. like you know. Everybody want to be out here, whatever the case may be, and it's okay. As long as you're doing it the smart way, it's okay, you know what I'm saying? But don't play with nobody hard, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, I definitely don't believe in that. You don't play with people's feelings, you don't play with people's heart, because karma is a bitch. Karma is a bitch. And females no need what, to understand, females need to understand when a nigga say, yo, listen, I ain't looking for nothing right now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And this is, and this is, you can't way, you though. can't put it in your head. Fuck with that nigga say that's my boyfriend. Real when I say and I ain't niggas looking need to be for the nothing. Same way, though. Devin, when I say I ain't looking for nothing, I, I'm looking for pussy. That's 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 what I'm telling you. Yes, yes. I ain't looking for nothing but that pussy. Simple as that. That's it. <laughs> yeah, I that's ain't it. looking for nothing. I'm trying to feel for something. That's, that's really like but, all. But, Tony, but guess what? This is the thing which kills me with this generation of guys, too. Everybody want to be known as a nigga that keep it real. These niggas I always want to be like, I'm real, I'm real, I'm real. But right. I'm telling you, these niggas can't keep it no. real to say they so lie. They if don't you be. just want a fuck, if you just want a fuck, buddy, just say that. Because uh, nine nigga, out of ten, uh, you can have a, a real bitch on your hand. That's on the same time. The nigga who keep it real ain't going to boast about it. That, you be having females that be on the same type of time. Look, nigga, I just want to bust a nut yeah, and she, keep it she, moving. I'm trying to I get some money. Hey, that's it, that's I, a, I mean, hit that motherfucker man, one more time. A little hey, bit of cunnilingus. That's she ain't lying, I'm cause it's, a, it's a lot. They love to be on that same type of time. They just want you to keep it real. Yeah, keep it. it, just keep it real. Look, I got four kids. They all play football. I got a business I'm running. I got clients. Look, I don't want no relationship, no commitment. I don't want you to do nothing for me. And if I want you to just be a fuck buddy, I'm going to just let you know this. I ain't even about to uh, pull. I ain't even about to have you yeah. thinking nothing else. Kia, I need you to do it something for me is. real quick. I need you to do something for, for you before you get out the phone. <laughs> I need y'all to do it for me. Put your hands up like this, Keon. Just put your hands up beside your head. We get ready to raise the motherfucking room. When you got them back. Just bend them back just a little bit, Keon. You got them back. You ready? You got them back. Uh We're going to raise the roof with this motherfucker. Because you in this bitch. You talking real shit. As she should. And that's why we fuck with you, man. Everything you said was a hundred. I swear. All Jesus. right. Race yeah. All right, y'all. But it go I'm both so... ways. All right, yeah. 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 Thanks for calling in, man. It Thanks for calling in. Great call. All right. Y'all have a good one. Do you right. too. Do, baby. Thank you. Damn, we fuck with Kiana, man. She got on here and said that. I swear. Yeah. You thought I was feeling you? Girl, I ain't <laughs> some of that pussy, man. <laughs> that 
That is all. I'm going to go ahead and let you know how I ain't never always. been no munch. I don't know how many niggas out here. I ain't never been here. no munch either. Man, I, I eat some proud munches it's out here. There's a lot here. of munches out this motherfucker. Hey, niggas is honored. Crazy, bro. They honored to be a I munch? Ain't never yeah. Been a, I don't uh, think I've ever been a munch. Because y'all honored him. Yeah. Like, hey, he feel blessed they, with the presence. So let's go. Oh, he in the group God. chat. Tell them the niggas that be in Getting the group chat. Oh, come on. <laughs> Getting talked about. Girl, what you need? Mean? You need some <laughs> mouth? Like, call such and such. put the tongue emoji beside you it, know man. you can hit him up. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he eat your ass. Girl, I heard. He, he ain't looking to hit. He eat your ass. I think some <laughs> men who, who consider themselves munches hey, have to compromise for their small penises. Munch. Oh, come on, man. I don't what want out of control. She said, Devin basically said, if you a munch, you got a small dick, nigga. So is that what it I is? I think sometimes that some well, men do oh, have to pre- compensate. Because he pressing you so hard? like No, nah, I'm saying like some guys that are like, you know, like the honor rollies that are, you know, proud to do it. Like sometimes they, they have to make up they for their small so penis in some oh type of way. God. It's a real thing. Like I'm not shaming, you know, the small penis men out there, but there are a group of them. <clears throat> <laughs> You hit up what he? Oh my god! <laughs> Damn! Okay, have you hey, have you yo. run a, have you run across one like that be- before? Like, oh, I, how many munches you run across? Ah, yeah. uh, <laughs> how did you like? How did we're you not quite, gonna do quite numbers a few. Here, right? How did oh, you go? Okay. How did you go about? Yeah, we're gonna one? Lead it. How did you go about one? Not of either, but to be honest, though, that man treated me better than a lot of other men. Okay. But like, hold on. Oh, he but, had to make up for other places. Okay, <laughs> let me ask you. I think you. if he had a big dick, he might not have been shit. That's the problem. Thanks. <laughs> not saying Come that all niggas is like it. that, but you never know. God you know what I mean? So let man. me ask you a question. Like, when you found out he was a munch, did you, was you nice to him? Like, it's okay. Like, did you try to, like, uh, rub his ego? Like, it's okay. You did good. Like, you know, like, it's you okay. Got it. You got it. You see my he, lip quiver. You like, <laughs> Get a bit of that. Nah, yeah, I'm I'm very Ooh. respectful. Hey, tell Kareem I'm very respectful. Call I'm, call I'm, I'm never gonna I'm never gonna step on niggas. Cause in your head, you strong. probably is like, look. Tell the call, call that in. that head. Yeah. Tell the call the call the in number. Hey, no. call the call in number. Yeah. Hey, Kareem, call the call in number. He definitely hey, put the call in number up there. Conversation. Kareem don't call my cell phone. Hey, yo, Kareem that, call the yeah. call in. Yeah, that's my dog. <laughs> that nigga, my nigga <laughs> calling in. Hold up. Yeah. Kareem call the goddamn call cell phone. Got Kareem call the other phone, would you? My nigga. That's my dog. Let him on the line. Hey, hey, hey shout out to all y'all watching, man. Shout out to everybody uh, been watching with me the whole time. Jazz, shout out to you. It's live. Kyle, tonight. shout out to you. It's hey, live. call Kareem. Tell Kareem to call the live. Jazz, what's up? My Damn. best. Yeah, what's the number, it's bro? Live tonight. Yeah, you call it. Yeah, that's a good. Yeah, that's shout good out to all y'all tuning in, man. Nine, nine is my good number. Hey, Tuesday look, hey, look. I don't even want to put her little business out, but earlier she was like, "Yo, is it? Have people ever been nervous?" I was like, "Hell yeah, yeah people have been nervous before." Hey. You feel me? Because I was nervous the first time my brother Snow wanted me on here. Yeah, you feel you, me? It's just a little jitters. You drunk that beer, nervous. you feeling yourself. Yeah, my, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now, you comfortable is now. Shit. Yeah, we should have yeah. did shots around this month. I mean, I if I'd have known, I would have, you know, I got bottles at the house. I, I wish got I a bottle had, on the car. I, should, I, I meant to bring it in. Good. Bring it in. I'll okay. reimburse you. I'm all right. Hey, I'm like, all right. Come on. I got bottles at the house. I would have stopped by the house and, you know. Keep that's, you lifted That's for some other time to keep some niggas lifted. What's happening, Jazz, man? We appreciate you tuned in, man. Shout hey, out to call Goddamn. Call in that call up, Shout man. out to Megan Duff, man. She always tuned in, man. Shout out to her. Y'all make sure y'all follow her, man. Shout out to Josh, too. Hey, hey, bro, you got to call the number on. Tell that nigga to call. Or did you is post it, it in it the posted? comments? It it's posted? in the comments. Post it again. Kareem been yeah. calling the Kareem been trying to FaceTime on the yeah. phone. Kareem. He tried. <laughs> hey, my nigga, <laughs> he trying, trying to get over here. Real, real hey, shit. my yeah, nigga got wrong. something to Yo. say. You hear me? He gonna get this shit off his chest. He that gonna tell real. y'all why the fuck he's saying. Got one left. Who's going to? What's up? Y'all ain't gonna yeah, speak. Go ahead, I'm Devin. Good. She empty. <laughs> Devin. Yeah, Devin shit dry as motherfucker over there. Boy. Hell, my bottle been empty. I'm good. <laughs> I'm a God real, I'm a, I like, I'm a real beer drinker. Like, not a lot of females cool. are, and like oh, at up, home, man? I drink my beer out of wine glasses. Like, I never drink out of bottles. This okay. Is the thing. Oh, but okay. this is good. That, that's you know, I'm be holding that motherfucker. Pinky up. Yeah, yeah, that that pinky yeah. Up. Like I'm just a yeah, classy yeah. lady. <laughs> now, Kareem definitely got something to say. Oh, that God. man yeah. calling everybody's cell phone. Nigga, call the right number. <laughs> <laughs> Tony, can you open this? For me? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Appreciate y'all for tuning in, man. Yeah, man, what's happening? Absolutely. 
Man, y'all make sure y'all call in, man. That call in number right now. We want to know why y'all single. We want to know why you... Kareem still calling myself. Hey, yep. <laughs> look, what's the number? Let me say what, what, what's, what's this? What's this again? What's this? Episode uh, 8? Episode 9. Episode 9. Episode, episode nine. 9. Call y'all. in. Hey. Call in. Let me know why you're single. Let me know why you, you're taking. Boy, Kareem trying to get... He got something to say. Boy, he blowing my I phone. I want to hear it. Yeah, why are we waiting for the crowd? We here for uh, it. Go back over this grand opening December first. <laughs> Nails by Devin. Right. Say that. Tune in. Get it in. <laughs> get it in. Get it in, honey. If you ain't came and got it, you need to come on and get it. Hey. All types of nails. There okay. you go. There you go. I'm gonna tell you what he. There we go. It's call cool number. They do it. It's a problem when I do it. Yeah. Kareem, goddamn, we finally called the right number. What's happening? What's going on with it, man? Same old <laughs> shit, man. We appreciate you calling in, man. Hey, the the, the topic was. Choosing to be successfully single. So you single out here, or you you got you a lady, Cream? No, I'm, I'm, I I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I <got> lady. <laughs> I'm not single. I'm not single. Hey, it's a lot of them out here that don't know, bro. So we ain't mad at you, man. <laughs> yeah. Nah, nah. What? Nah, I got a lady. You got a lady, man. What? I mean, what made you want to be in a relationship? You know. Not be single. No, it's fun to be single, but it's also fun to be in a relationship. What made you want to be in a relationship? Said, the fuck up. Oh yeah, yeah. You shouldn't have called, nigga. You shouldn't have called. Cause we put you out here, nigga. That was the question. That nigga so nervous. He forgot the question. Goddamn. Nah, I ain't gonna put you on the spot like that, man. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. What, what, what was the question? Nah, now what? What makes you want to be in a, in, a, in a relationship instead of being single right now? Oh, you know, I mean, I'm tired of living that player life. Sometimes you gotta just do what you gotta do. Shout straight up. Nah, that's that's facts, bro. Mm. Don't get no realer than that. I, and I think I'm to the. I, that's where I'm at right now, Kareem. I, I, I'm trying to do what I got to do because, man, that single shit don't get played after me. I feel like so when well, you don't hit what you wanted to hit, get old. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, get old. Got all the flavors. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's, Basket it's and like, Robbins. Basket oh, and Robbins. I'm trying to say, is that. That's exactly what it is. Yeah, man. I'm going to tell you something, so, right? Go yeah, ahead, bro. When I was single, right? A lot of these motherfuckers that was in these females' inboxes, and I'm laying in the bed, and I'm next to them, and they like, look, 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 look at this nigga. I, 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 they be sh- I, like, showing you. Like, showing me, right? <laughs> Show, you showing me that part. Show me your part, right? So it just, it, it, it raises flags because, like, you opening it. Like, real <coughs> fact, she ain't going to open that shit. Mm-hmm. She ain't going to pay no attention. No, none of that. Like, nice. like she gonna check it. She gonna show you she checked it too. You Straight know what up. I'm saying? So a lot of that shit right there be red yeah, flag. You yeah, show me girl. you checked it. You gonna <laughs> show me some shit? Show me you checked it. Yeah. I don't give a fuck what he said. A nigga gonna be a nigga. Yeah. You yeah. bad? Whatever the case may. A nigga gonna be. Show me what you said. I feel you. Show on me that. your reply. Mm. Man, shout out to uh, shout out to Nikki Pinks, man. You know, Cream, man. We yeah, appreciate nah, you bro. calling in too, bro. Yeah, cat. we ain't we ain't try to set you up either, yeah, big did. brother. Oh no, nah, no, nah, I know my nigga. I'm just hey, look. Let me say this. You know, long as you you in a relationship and you dealing with somebody and they bring something to the table and y'all have a partnership and agreement and y'all got each other back, that's what that's all I ever been looking for. Right. It's, it's, mm-hmm. it's these fake motherfuckers that are talking about they got your back, and then as soon as the shit get hot and get real, yeah, then they on to the next nigga that's on got the them. next nigga on it, the next thing. The, the next Louis and it all took that. no you effort, yeah. no effort, zero effort, yeah. all yeah. zero yeah. effort. Got them to a little bit of time, and then they got them fly to Yeah, zero effort, zero effort. Yeah, so. It's crazy. So, you know, but you got I'm, my I'm back at, though. You got my best interest. Already, I got. I'm at a point where you know, I feel like I have a partnership where we got each other back, like as far as what you know that ups and down, trials and tribulations. But no matter what, I'm not going to judge her. She's not going to judge me. We're going to mm. move forward together, regardless of what anybody else thinks or say. That's just what it is. That's where I be at. Yeah. So I'm happy. 
it's cool when they do it. It's a it's problem, problem when I, I do it. Ah, fuck them. Fuck them. Uh, I, I ain't fucking them. Uh, I'm going to forgive them. Forgive them. Yeah, yeah, forgive them. You're right. I, I do too. I forgive them. We forgive them. We forgive them. I forgive them. Because we going to forgive them. Because they don't know no better. They don't. They know not what they see. That's the majority yeah. of these hoes. I don't and that'd be I the biggest them. thing. Damn, but hey, listen, okay. let me tell you, the oh. hardest thing is forgiving somebody in your personal oh, yeah, time. That's one of the absolutely. hardest things. You, regardless of what people say or what they think, oh, no, I would have did this, or I would have did that. Uh, this, that, the third. Yeah. Motherfucker, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> shut the fuck up. You wouldn't have uh, did a motherfucking yeah, thing. Yeah. Because if niggas know you, they know you. When they know you did yep. that shit, you did that shit. Mm-hmm. Point blank, yeah. period. Okay. You ain't got to explain yourself to nobody. And they're going to let you Do know. shit for nobody. No, none of that. Prove yourself. None of these motherfuckers. Get you some money. Mm-hmm. How about yeah, that? When you, with a, when, you with a, when you deal with somebody and they had your best interest, then you know you don't judge them on what they've done in their past. They don't. And they don't judge you what you do on your past. Because as long as both of y'all have it, that's all that matters. That's all that matters. Can't nobody tell you shit about them either. I don't. I don't yeah. feel like anybody exactly. can just walk into my relationship and tell me shit about my nigga. I don't give a fuck who he exactly. you fucked your sister. I didn't have nothing to do with yeah. that. It was before me. Yeah, yeah. you wouldn't dare do no shit like that to me. Well, hold on, yeah, for sure. If you tell me my girl fuck you, I'm gonna say shit. What she uh, what we all fuck. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, shit, she told me that uh, the other day anyway. So we don't die. <laughs> <laughs> the bitch is mine now. Yeah. yeah she, she belong to me, man. Yeah, you can't fuck her while she with uh, You should have kept her when you yeah. had her. Mm-hmm. Right. Exactly. Must have been fucking up. Exactly. Exactly. True, indeed. She my, she my diamond now. I found her. It's cool when they her. do it. It's a problem when I do it. Them. Fuck them. <laughs> no, matter of fact, forgive them. Forgive them. Forgive them. We gonna forgive. Cream, man, we appreciate you calling in, man. Sure, bro. Make Call. sure you got. I'll see that next week. Yeah, man. You already know. Get your ass here. We need you on here. Yeah, we gotta get a real topic. Yes, a real spicy topic. Hey, you, <laughs> hey, yo, you got you a week to think about. Hey. You got a week to think about. <laughs> you got a whole week to think about it. So I'm gonna be hitting you up All on right. it. Oh, okay, say less. All right, all right, fam. Right, be safe. Be safe, safe bro. Yes, sir. All right. All right. Yep. Peace. Boy, that's Kareem, man. He came on here speaking some real shit. Y'all can call in to that call in number, man. Let me know why you we single. We had somebody calling, too. Yo, okay. Y'all been blowing shout me up, Shout out to man. y'all. Yeah, for real. Hey, shout, shout out. out shout man, out. Real, shout man. out to Doggy. Shout out to Doggy. Yeah. PG. PG got the battle on the 20th. You know what I'm saying? He's... I don't know if uh, Canapolis or Concord ever had a uh, battle rapper like, like, succeed to the level like PG succeed to, but like, bro, it's That's like really on this battle Shout rap out shit. To PG. You know what I'm saying? It's the doggy. He really like he on that battle rap shit and he going hard. You That's know what I'm up. saying? That's what's for up. the town. Shout out to so, you know what I'm saying? Man. Shout out to Shout Jay out, Adam, you know boy. what I mean? <laughs> We couldn't do this shit without Jay Adam, man. Shout out to Jay that, Adam. Man. Yep. Boy. Hold on. Shout out, shout out. Hold on. Hold on. Let me talk my shit. Because <laughs> I seen a post, right? I seen a post. Let me get a little, let me get a little active. Let because I don't man. be making no posts like that. Um, let me say this. Me and Ev. Me and Ev. Birthday party. Mm-hmm. You remember when 1903 was like yeah. dying down a little bit? Yeah, you know, a little bit. You know what I'm saying? We ain't had no buzz. Right. Me and I, I contact Elk. Me and Elk put together a birthday party. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I put together, it was just two of us on a flyer other than the performances. And, sh- and shout out to my performances. I had T Burner. Yep. I had OG Booski. I had Rambo. Yep, yep. I had Snow. Hey, well, hey now. What? You know what I'm saying? Right, now. We try now. I had Family 500. <laughs> and I had Ruger. I had a hell of a lineup, right? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. And I had Clutch. Then oh, I, yeah, had clutch. To clutch. Yeah, I had Clutch. I had Clutch. I had Clutch too. Young boy going crazy. My motherfucking lineup was crazy. Crazy. 
that was my first time promoting a party, right? And I had motherfuckers hating, hating over that party. This is and look, look, watch this. Watch after I say this shit, you're going to see the post. Ah, that motherfucker lying. He did it. I ain't no motherfucker. They was watching. <laughs> nigga, you took the blueprint, nigga. Yeah. Stop playing. Yeah. You took the blueprint and you ain't stopping nothing. I don't have to post shit. I don't have to continuously every day get on social media and pop shit. I'm, I'm, I'm not doing that. Word yeah. of mouth. I'm not doing that. You could do that. Shit. If you got to do that to stay relevant, do that. What's, what's your DJ name? Well, I was nigga, about to I'm say DJ that. relevant, nigga. Uh, that nigga and I'm in more than relevant. I'm in more than one city, hey, one time yo. for that so nigga Real, DJ how, Relevant. Hit that goddamn flame on that ass. Yes, sir. Yeah. Real, how are they hating on your Big Real on your party? I, I I see the subliminals, you know, but it ain't none of that. They ain't tagging nobody, you know. I see the subliminals, people, you know, and all that. You know, you know they don't throw subliminals. And I see, That's what I see, do. you know, when you came to my yeah. event. If I booked you to perform, it wasn't no continuous, bro, what time we going on? What time we going on? What time we going on? I'm going to put you on. See, these promoters, some of these promoters, not all of them, some of these promoters Jankies. will have you in the wind hanging. Oh, go holla at the DJ and put mm-hmm. the DJ on the back burner. Like, oh, bro, didn't give me the setup. Like, when you, you see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So you don't know who who to go first with or no, none of that. You ain't get all the music or whatever the case may be. I had all my music for my event. All my music. I went up there and did that shit myself. Thanks. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Look, Ray, before we get out of here, man, before before we get hey, look, out of here. Tony, look, Tony, look, Tony, see Tony, see Tony like, look, 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 hey, Tony yo. like, you know what? Hey, but yo. this is what we here for. Yeah, that's what we here for, This man. is what we here for. It's what y'all wanted, right? I'm going to give you them views. Go ahead. It's what <laughs> you want. Do it, do it, do it. <laughs> we going to get ready to get out of here. Before we get out of here, back to this party, yeah. though, Ray, on my yeah. end. What other nigga you know have showed up to a fucking party in an all pink fucking suit? Man, shit the whole nobody put this your nigga here. Ass. Nobody this put nigga this here. Across, Listen, <laughs> the day of my party, this nigga here. We cut the music. Dapper. This nigga here say, "Nigga, <laughs> my chains cost more than all you niggas scat pack out there, you bitch ass niggas." I said, "Oh, hey, shout out to I, ain't, I ain't know what to man. say. I ain't know what this. It was my party. I ain't know what." I put the microphone in my pocket and I walked away. I went to go get some chicken. I ain't shit, y'all. Okay. I ain't shit. I showed up to that nigga's birthday in an all pink suit and I all talked pink shit suit the whole and went crazy. You gonna look better than the fucking birthday boy. I was I wasn't trying to. I went to a Man, different that nigga event. showed out. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> that nigga showed up and showed out. That's what nah. you supposed to do. Yeah. Nah. He showed up and showed out. Uh man, real, tell them how they can follow you on, on, on social man. media. Know how you can follow me is R E double L A V E N T relevant on Instagram, and you know it's real Whaley on Instagram. I mean on Facebook. So um, my TikToks is DJ relevant. Um, come on, man! Like y'all know where to follow me. I post everywhere. I I, I mix this shit up. I mix this shit up. I put Instagram shit on Facebook. I put TikTok on Facebook. Whatever you know where to follow me at, man. If you wanna follow me, you wanna follow me. I don't cap, I don't do none of that shit. I don't make believe because we in the same neighborhood, we still shop at the same Walmart. So I don't make believe. So you can believe all that cap shit out there all you want. Same Wally world. You know what I'm saying? It's cap. It's cap. We in the same neighborhood. Devin, how can we follow you? Same area code. Okay, so following me on social media. Uh, my personal is Debbie K on Instagram. We also mm. have my nails page, Nails by Devin. That's hey. Devin with an I. We also have my skincare page, Divine hey. Cure. Same thing for Hello. Facebook, um, except for my personal on Facebook is Devin Kirkpatrick. My nails, um, that page is Nails by Devin on Facebook. Facebook for the skincare line is Divine Cure. Period. And I think that's it. T, how can we follow you on social media, man? <laughs> period. You got to put a period behind, period behind that. Yeah. Shit. Big one. And a dash. But look, yeah, y'all can follow me on Instagram, man. Big Burner. Burner is spelled B U R two N's and an A. B U R N N A underscore 704. 
Facebook, Bernard Alexander. You already know what it is, man. Just follow me, man. Step like in. Love man. y'all. Love y'all. Man, this was the Tony Snow Love Show y'all. episode nine, man. You already know how to follow me on social media. We're going to be doing this shit each and every Tuesday night, same time, 9 o'clock. If you want to be a guest, man, hit my hit me on the inbox. I got some dates available. And I appreciate y'all tuning in, man. We fucking gone. Yeah.